Hello everyone, how you doing? Welcome to Game Tech UK. Welcome to another morning. What day is it today? It's Tuesday today. We must keep on with what day it is. Keep up to date. Otherwise, the, the days just merge into one another. We're going to be playing some tourist bus. A tourist bus. I keep saying tourist bus. It's no, there's no bus in it. Tourist bus simulator. I've been promising this for a little while. Um, and I've set it all up. I've just started a brand new game. So we're going to start. Here we are, we're in the airport, um, and we literally just started a game. I haven't played it at all. All I've done, all I've done, is gone in and set up all, all the key bindings. Um, that's all I've done. So uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do today. How are you, anyway? Is the most, Im as always, the most important question. I've got a cheeky cup of tea. Um, so who have we got in? Hundred people already. Thank you very much. Let's say some names, right? Yeah, right from the beginning. All I've done, all I've done is gone in. I've got the bus. I've set up the key bindings or most of the key bindings, and we're starting completely afresh. We're in the airport at the moment. We've just landed on the Spanish island of Fuerteventura. Uh, we're going to go to work and set up a bus company. That's what we're going to do. Um, so who have we got here? We've got Elfie Callum's here. Hello, Lee. How are you? We've got Stefan. We've got McNoble. Pete's here doing promotion. Hello, Harry. we got uh, Zach. Brett. CJ's here. Matthew. Oh, my God. It's going fast. Puppers. Philip. How are you doing? Uh, Stansky. We've got Stimson in here. Bush Walston. We've got Ernest Flame. We've got J.A. We've got Alex. Emojis. Hello, John. How are you? Coffin Dodger. Of course, we've got Graham in here. We've got Stu, Unpopular Gaming. We've got Stretchmaster P. We've got loads of people. Timmy and Jimmy, Tim and Jim. we got George J. We've got T-Rock, Paul Morris. How are you all? Thank you for coming in. And Ian Jones, of course. And um, Gordon and Reese is the best. And of course, we've got Leanne with us as well. So I would just ask you, and Red, he's not here. I would just ask you, would you leave me a little cheeky like? It would really help out the stream. Um, I don't know if this game is sort of coming to the channel or whether it's going to be a big fixture on the channel. But certainly I am interested in playing. I was looking, um, I was looking into this game and it does seem that it's poorly op optimised. Even the high-end cars have trouble running it. But couple of days ago they released a beta of a brand new version of the unreal engine so hopefully fingers crossed if we do bring this to the channel and it is something we play hopefully their new version that will obviously come to retail uh, will run a lot better but i like what i see so far i've got a cut yeah oh this interests me more than regular it's quite deep actually there's a lot a lot of stuff to do in this a lot of stuff and um, it's pretty good. And it's set on the real island of Fuerteventura. One in five um, scale as well. Whereas, say, something like Euro Truck is one in 20. So this is quite detailed of that um, of the island. So it's all good, yeah. Yeah, it's all good. Hello, Beard. How are you? No, I think you're going to like it. Do you think it will ever come to PlayStation 4? Well... I thought no, but the fact that they're still updating it and updating the Unreal Engine, possibly, I'll have to ask the question, um, it, it could possibly come to PlayStation 4 and Xbox, wouldn't it be great? But this is, um, you can walk around, it's really good, I think, you, I think actually you're going to enjoy it. So we're going to have a couple of hours together. I'm not going to rush through the game. I'm going to take my time. We're going to look at everything. You've got space legs. right? We're just going to chill. It's Tuesday morning. You know, most of us are at home, so that's cool. Some of us are still at work, and well done to everyone that's still got to go in. My wife's at work today. Um, so I've got a couple of hours here, and then tonight I've got a stream for you, a free-hour endurance at Barfurst on Gran Turismo. Right. Yes, it is Tuesday. Right, let's, uh, so I've just started the game. I've literally just started, and it wants me to um, go out and uh, get in my car. So let's go and do that. So even straight away, like someone said, already it looks cool. Already it does. So this is the airport, and I'm liking the detail so far, I must say. Oh, you feel that. You know, when you come out the airport and suddenly you got the aircon in the airport and suddenly it's like, whoo, as you walk out. That's what we got here. So this is my car. It's a bit beaten up. It's a bit beaten up. Right, okay. So let's, uh, let's go. So I think we're going to drive... Oh, we're driving to the company. Yeah. This <laughs> is freaking yeah, Graham. I can't hear any of that, mate. <laughs> no, nah, this is the car. This is the car. 
it does look good, yeah. Uh, I, I, like I say, I played it for about half hour last night setting up the key bindings. There's a lot. It's not certainly wasn't plug and play for my steering wheel, um, but uh, yeah. Get in the boat, yeah, exactly. So we're just going from the airport to our bus company. That's the first thing we're doing. But this is set um, and based on Fuerteventura, which is cool. I've never actually been there, but uh, it's a Spanish island, and I know it is. I've checked it before I said it, all right? <laughs> no game sound. Um, can you can you hear that? It's very quiet. It's just um, it's only a little car. Yeah, I haven't... W what, you can't hear that at all? Let me have a look. It might just be that it's really quiet. Let me have a look. Let's turn it up to there. Yeah, the graphics do look good. Yeah, they do look good so far. It's only more... It's only sort of a rumble. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's more of a rumble than anything. Right, let's take our time, because we're going... Um, we're going to our company. Yeah, Gaza, um, this is um, it's a very, very poorly optimised game at the moment. Um, there's a lot of people on the um, on the forum saying, you know, I've got like a, a 20 series card and I'm having trouble running it. I've turned everything down as much as I can to still make it look good. But a couple of days ago, they released um, on their website a beta that you can download. Um, I think you have to buy the game, but you can download the beta that will obviously come to retail and it's using the new version of the Unreal Engine. So hopefully that will be a lot better optimised because I definitely like what I see. But I want to turn the detail on the resolution up a little bit. But it looks fine. It looks fine so far. So we're driving to our company. Yeah, but that could be why they're using um, or updating it to the latest version. You know, it could be. Yeah, there is seated dash on this, but I don't think we're going to be in this car very long anyway. So I'm not going to worry too much about that. Hello, Daniel. It's certainly got a nice... It has got a holiday look to it, hasn't it? It's got quite a convincing holiday island. Apparently the mirrors... I turned the graphics down in the mirrors, and that did help a lot. Yeah, it did help a lot. Can we see the interior? Yeah. Yeah, you can. Yeah, so this is... Uh, this is this is our, just our little run around, I think. I don't think this... I think we're almost at the company. So don't worry too much about this car, because I think... We're going to uh, get in our bus. This was actually sent to me ages ago, so I don't know how much it is. I think it's about twenty-five quid um, on PC. It's not. It's not like crazily expensive. There's a lot of roundabouts, yeah. Oh, it looks like this is our company. Okay, this is our company. Yeah, definitely unpopular, yeah. Can we go faster? No. It feels like Spain. It is Spain. Yeah, it is Spain. Right, okay, let's let's park up here. See this is as far as I got, just checking the um the binders. I haven't got any further than this. And one thing I did notice one thing I did notice was this. Right. Oh company name, okay. Game tech um game tech travel. Let's go game tech travel. We got to, haven't we? One thing I did notice was... Where, oh, it's chucked me all the way over there. One thing I did notice, which was very interesting, was this, right? We've got this old wrecker, so I come up to it. You can actually build stuff. You know, we can go and collect stuff and actually start... There's a lot to this game, I think. A lot. But let's go into... Um, let's enter our company. So this is our little bus company. Oh, look at this. Go to the computer and find uh, buy our first bus. Okay, so let's do that. Let's go to second-hand vehicles. Um, yeah, let's go Lions into City. Lions into... Yeah, let's go Lions into City. We'll just buy any one components. Yeah. Oh, it hasn't got Wi-Fi. Okay. Let's... Um, oh, 61. Hasn't got wipers. Okay. <laughs> Let's go with the top one. Okay, so we've got to go and collect it from the harbour. 
Uh, go to the wall clock and open the cannon. If it's glitchy, it's only because my mouse is here, by the way. It's nice and it's um, you know it's nice and smooth. It's just my my little glitchiness. Look, there's loads of detail here, isn't there? Look at this. Look. What's that here? What's that? Oh, we got like an extra office. Look. Oh, this is quite cool, isn't it? Repaint your bus. Oh, nice. Okay, let's go. Uh, I think we have to forward time. So let's go to the calendar. And it's this one. Vehicle collection. So we've got to drive to the harbour in Porta de Rosia. You're going to get lots of pronunciation of these Spanish names. And I know you're going to be impressed. I know it. Hello, Scarab. How are you? Okay, back in our car. <laughs> Delicious. Put the fence. No. Put the Delorosio. <laughs> yeah, this is um, basically a. Um, not a mod, but like a, another version of Fernbus. Fernbus apparently is a lot more detailed than this, um, believe it or not. But uh, yeah, this is more of a cut down version of Fernbus. Yeah, they're indicators, yeah. So we've got to drive to the harbour. Suddenly Italian. Alright, Luke. Hola. Hola. <laughs> Hello, loading. What's up? What's happened with YouTube then? There's always normality here. Yeah. Although, if you think it's normal, that means you're abnormal like us, which means you fit in perfectly. Because this is not normal here. Yeah? <laughs> Yeah, the buses can break down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You've got to, um, you've got to fix them, as you saw there. Like, you know, they need oil changing. It's it's, um, it's far more detailed than bus sim. Far more detailed. Whether it, whether that means it's better, I mean, that's a question we'll have to answer. Ask, isn't it? But um, yeah, the car does feel a little bit floaty. But let's 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 judge it when we get in the bus. I think the bus apparently is a lot better than these buses. Uh, these cars, sorry, because I don't think you're in the car very often. 27 quid, so not the cheapest by um, uh, any sort of PC gaming uh, mark. I haven't set up the look, look left and right in the car. Exactly, uh, Khan. Yeah, exactly. The car is always awful, bus is far better. Yeah, that's what I read, so I'm not going to worry about um, setting up um, seats and all that. We're just going to, yeah, apparently it is a little bit rubbish, the car. It does feel like it's got a flat. But anyway, let's not worry about the car. Let's look at the scenery. It's got a, it has got a really, oh, look, there's the planes going off, look. It's got quite a cool little look to it, hasn't it? Yeah, if it plays well, yeah, yeah, definitely. <coughs> Actually, have a look on CD keys. Yeah, there's a link in my description. Um, CD keys may have it cheaper. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> on to Mohammed. What stream were you playing on? Oh, is he keep? Okay, sorry, I didn't keep you keep bloody spamming. Mohammed, you know this. Just ask, and I will see it. It's a Frostmaster TGT. No, it's a Spanish island. Yeah. Oh look at this! It does look it does look really nice actually, and this is um, this isn't on the highest graphics because it's poorly optimized. Poorly optimized, so um, you can't run it on full. You just can't. It's so poorly optimized. But like I say, a couple of days ago, I thought this this game was not over, but I didn't think they were doing much to it. But I just saw on their Steam page that oh that you can download the beta for the next version, the improved version, which two things one it'll be great um two could that mean it's coming to console i mean why would they be bothering to upgrade it it's, it's quite a, an old game now people have either got it loved it got it moved on won't go back to it so it does make me think that mm, i wonder if this is i wonder if this is coming to console which would be awesome yeah i wonder if they've seen the success that bus uh, bus sim has, has had on console and thought yeah well we we might be able to transfer this over but there's a, there is actually a lot to do in this game. It's not just a drive and pick up game. Absolutely not. It is more than that. But bus sim. <laughs> a table and chair just fell over there. What's going on there? I'm 
I'm doing this with a mouse because I haven't set any controls up. It's just so annoying. The key binding is a bit of a pain. You have to set up the key bindings individually for the car, um, for each bus. It is a bit of a pain. So that's why I'm not too worried about this car because I think we're going to spend most of it in the, the coach or the bus. So, oh, look at this. Look, this looks really nice, doesn't it? It does look absolutely nice. Hello, Madela. Right, we're going to pick up our coach. No, but that's what I'm saying, Madman. Why have they suddenly gone for an upgrade of the Unreal Engine and a new beta that's coming soon? That makes me think that, um, they, yeah, they could, yeah. I couldn't see an option for that, Luke. If you go into controls, there's different ones. Car, walk-in, and each bus. There was no setting for copying. Kyle, thank you very much, mate. I appreciate that. There's the noise. Thank you, Kyle. You're a lovely geezer. Look at this. It's very detailed. Very detailed. Looks like our coach is here. Okay. It says it's a Spanish island, Fuerteventura. It's in Spain. So, we're going across to our coach. This is our coach. It's a man in the city. Or M-A-N, however you want to say it. Look at this, look. Oh yeah, this is good. This is good. It's really detailed, I must say. It's like, there's a lot of detail here. A lot. And it's got pigeons and seagulls. I mean, who don't love that? Oh, yeah. Oh, you bussing fans. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we don't want the radio on. It's full of um, proper copyright music. I've just been schooled on geography by Jason. The world is upside down. You can smell how old the bus is. Yes, you can. Yeah. Right. Let's 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 go. Let's do this. Oh, we got to do the display. Okay. It is cool, Lee. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's um. There's more to do, isn't there? There's more to do. Oh, look at that. <laughs> yeah, this is cool. No, I've got it on auto at the moment, Steve, so um when you uh when you close when you stop when you pull away, they all close. Now I did play with the field of view. The field of view is, is really close. Obviously, the further you go back, the more you're cutting into your frames as well. So I've gone with a sort of happy medium of, um, of this view. Hello, Snowy. How are you? Yeah, yeah. It's, um, it certainly looks detailed, yeah. Well, thank you, Carl. I appreciate that, mate. Genuinely. I have got track IR unpopular. I have got it. I just don't think it suits, suits me playing. I don't think it suits you watching because if I'm moving my head the whole thing is going to be moving and it's going to make you dizzy yeah the track IR is good um, but I don't like it from a stream point of view I'd, I'd rather you have a static um, image I think it's better you spent a, a, a fortune on Steam yeah I bet right oh let's take it slow round it whoa Oh my good god. Oh, that, I, I felt the weight of that push behind me. Okay, so there is proper bus physics as well. Yeah, there is bus physics. Right. Oh, and they're big as well. Look at this. Oh, I like that aspect of the game. The fact that um, you've you got a big coach here and tiny little um, winding streets. I like that. So the drive itself is a challenge. I like that. Yeah, definitely unpopular. Yeah, that's good. Now I've zoned in with that. Yeah, we've got to be careful. Yeah, it makes you feel like you're on holiday. Yeah, it does lean realistically. Yes, yes, it does. I like it. So far, so good. Oh, 
Oh my, oh! I've got a cup that says Port Aventura. I thought it said Fort Aventura. I'm like, what? But I've never been there. But I've been to Port Aventura. <laughs> like, what? I thought I'd never been there. Why? If I have been there and I don't realise, why have I got a cup? <laughs> but there's restaurants to um, discover. You can take people to restaurants. You can hire staff. You got to buy, uh, give them somewhere to live. Yeah, it's good. Ian Jones, thank you. Oh, thanks, mate. Another awesome stream in these tough times. I'm really enjoying doing as many streams as possible. And hopefully you're seeing the increase in streams. It's to the detriment of videos. I haven't got any time to make videos. But hopefully you're enjoying all the extra streams I'm trying to put on for you. Just to keep the channel busy, really. Give you something to do if you fancy um, a couple of hours off. Or a couple of hours chatting to me and the rest of these lovely people here. Um... Yeah, yeah, no worries, Matt. I, I will, um, I'll contact you, mate. <laughs> Deco, yeah, you wished. Thank you, Snowy. No, I like it. You know, it's, um, like I say, I've spent nearly three years building up the community. And now the community is literally, it, it's like it was made for this. It's come into its own, isn't it? You know, there's loads of people indoors. Um, there's loads of people playing with each other as well. No, <laughs> playing with each other as well. You're not just waiting for me to stream. You're hooking up with each other, um, and I love that. It is, yeah. The view looks really nice, doesn't it? Yeah, easy, yeah. So I'm not going to rush. This is a big old vehicle, actually. I've just realised that there's proper physics here. I felt, as I as I lost it around that corner, I felt the weight pushing behind me of the, the actual vehicle. So there's a, there's a lot going on here. No, there's no multiplayer. I mean, there might be a mod, I don't know, but no, there's no multiplayer. Right, we're back in our little town here. Right, this is this is what this is our bus company just up here, isn't it? Yeah, I recognise this. Certainly more complex than bus simulator straight away. Straight away. Straight away it seems more complex. Time for some bus racing, yeah. So you got restaurants that you can discover to take people. But you can see a little bit of glitchiness in the frames, but hopefully, fingers crossed, if they've got this um I will I'll bring the um I will download the beta and see what it's like. I'll stream that as well. See if there's a difference in performance. pretty cool pretty cool I like the fact that you know you can do this sort of stuff look like if you've only just come in I saw this when we started and I clicked up to it I said like, oh okay buggy that you can actually find parts I don't know where we're gonna find this I haven't got a clue but the fact that you can do that what's in here what's in here oh my good gold we can fix it and everything look at this <laughs> I like this <laughs> this is cool I like this Okay, we've got to enter our office. I like the fact it's a bit run down. I wonder if we ever move from here. I wonder if we move. Right, back to our office. Go to the fax, ma fax machine. What's this, the 90s? Right, the fax machine. Okay. <coughs> click on this button to see the orders. Then click on the order to confirm it. You can find your accepted orders by clicking on this, on this button. Okay. Is the beta the same game but improved? Yes, yes. Yeah, just um, they're moving it to a newer version of the Unreal Engine, so it should theoretically be just be the same game but running a lot sweeter and in any, any improvements, you know. Um, new orders. So we're going to go to El Morato, which is this one, to Porta del Rocio. <laughs> I've gone Spanish again. <laughs> okay, let's come out of here. Open, open the calendar again and skip to the next appointment. So you can just pass time or we can jump straight there. Which is that one, isn't it? Scheduled trip. Okay, board your bus. Yeah, yeah, this is um, so far so good. It's definitely, it's piqued my interest. It's got my interest, you know. Um, it seems a lot different. Either, it's a bit like how we talk about truck driver 
and bus sim yeah they both got vehicles in this is like bus sim of course it's got buses in it but it seems nothing like that at the moment nothing like that look at the dirt on the oh look at that look <laughs> So I'm guessing we've got washing facilities. We must have, mustn't we? Yeah, we must have. Very cool. It's all nice. Uh, like the interiors don't look as nice as Bus Sim, for example. But, you know, we're not here to compare. I'm just saying. Um, yeah, it's cool. Yes, he did, Carl. Yes, he did. Okay, set it into reverse. Okay. Start the. Uh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. That's it. the bags I mean it does actually look nice and I've got the I've got the, the um, graphical settings I haven't got them all on high because I want to make the frames as smooth uh, for you as possible right okay so we're gonna go to our first stop so this is this is where it becomes bus simulator I suppose um, so this uh, is gonna have a look I'm gonna drive it a lot slower than I first imagined because it's it's a long bus and you got this button as well which can go through um, what you're up to so it's got all... Oh, I love that view. I love that. So it's got all the features of... Um, a bus sim where you can touch the dashboard and all that, you know? No, we're not playing Blue Shirt, blue shirt yet. Um, Ash, I've got a Titan X. The first one, the Pascal one. Not the most recent. The early, the early one. No, I'm not flooring it. It's interesting, isn't it? It's interesting. Cool. I haven't seen it, Graham. What is it? It's 27 quid on um, on Steam. But if you ch can, someone click on my link below, uh, my CD keys link, and see if it's on there. Because if it is, you can get it cheaper and support the channel as well. Uh, but it's 27 pound on Steam, which still isn't expensive, is it? Yeah, character models. Yeah, we'll we'll check all that as uh, people get on the bus. 320. <laughs> I can't believe that's going to be 320. Not in a million years. Not in a million years. If it is, I'll have two. Because I need two, don't I? Especially for Gran Turismo for the old uh, camera. It's not on CD case. Okay, 27 quid. Oh, this is my stop. Oh, dear. There's me chatting away. Sorry, everyone. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> They're like, oh, game tech travel, eh? Come on, everyone, get in. Go on, in you go. <laughs> well, this is pretty cool, isn't it? Go what are you looking at, mate? What are you looking at? Oh, you two sisters. What, don't you? Oh, and she, we've got a ghost. We've got a ghost. It doesn't appear that any of them have luggage, which is a shame. Um, yeah, 320 quid. I'll be very surprised if it's 320 quid. It's going to be more than that. Do you know when you're streaming next? John, let me finish this one first, mate. Cool. <laughs> Check out that granny. P. you've been indoors too long. Stop it. Okay, so we've got a route here. We've got a route. So you can see all the doors close. I've got the doors um, on simple at the moment. Um, a bit like a bit like um, Euro Truck, you know, where you can put things like all the sliders up. At the moment, I've done that. Um, eventually, if I am going to continue playing it, I'll put all my stuff onto the button box uh, for doors and stuff. But at the moment, I've just left it on sort of simple, you know. <laughs> you left all the luggage in the shelter. Yeah, that's all right. They don't need it. We're only taking them to the zoo. It's only a little trip. Get your tip basket, yeah. So, hello everyone, we're going down into Resort. I hope you're enjoying your holiday here on the island of Fortaventura. <laughs> yeah, it was a pain, Madman. Yeah, it was a bit of a pain. <laughs> we have got air conditioning for your comfort. <laughs> Snowy, watch that week be. 
<laughs> Jason's lost it. <laughs> My name is Juan. I drive the bus. <laughs> and too late. It does. It's sort of like putting me in a good mood. It feels. It feels like a holiday, doesn't it? We're all going on a on a summer holiday, and I know a song about that. <laughs> He needs to get it, well, yeah. Sean Hontek, you okay? <laughs> I drive the bus. I just drive the bus. That is it. I just drive the bus. I come home. I go to bed. I get up. I drive the bus. <laughs> I finish. I go to bed. I get up. I drive the bus again. Oh, we're going across here. Okay. Uh, we're going in this one. <laughs> Get my Cliff Richard on, yeah. <laughs> Loving the accents. <laughs> it's real life, yeah. Christmas Day, I'm driving the bus. Birthday, I drive the bus. <laughs> oh, I'm fluent in so many accents, yeah. <laughs> What's his business name? Um, Game Tech, Game Tech Travel. We've called it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think we're just. Are we orange? Or, no, no. We're going round here. Are we orange? Or are we? You know, we can go here. Yeah, let's go here. We're a bus. So I think we're dropping them off here at the station. Yeah, yeah, we are. There's so many characters in my locker. <laughs> This is where we're going. This is pretty cool. I like it. It's very cool, actually. Very cool. <laughs> Free dislikes from real Spanish people. Right, let's uh, park up here. You coming on or getting off? Oh, you're all getting off. Oh, I don't, um, they're sort of popping out. That's a bit of a shame. That oh, <laughs> that's a bit. This way, love. What are you going up? Oh yeah, the new people are getting on. Okay. Oh, that's quite cool. Okay, we won't worry about that little sort of um, graphical glitch. We'll accept it for what it is. It's totally fine. So yeah, so far so good, eh? What do you think in the chat? Tell me what you think. I, I quite like it. It's um. To me, it feels like bus sim and some more. That's what it feels like instantly, um, which is it's not a bad thing, is it? It's definitely not a bad thing. It feels, it certainly feels more alive. This feels, this feels, um, it almost feels better graphics than sort of Euro Truck. It's different, isn't it? It's different, yeah. Hello, Zalid, how are you? Yeah. The coaches, yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh, I like it, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. <laughs> yeah, they're spawning into a parallel gaming universe, yeah. It's like Fernbus Little Sister. It is, Paul. It is exactly the same car uh, game. Exactly the same. Okay, where do you want me to drive? I drive the bus. Beep, beep, beep. I'm doing my own noises because, come on, you need, you need reversing noises, don't you? Oh, <laughs> no, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. What did I hit? What did I hit? Oh, I hit another bus. I hit Sean's bus. It's fine. I know him. He's totally fine. He's fine. That was a Spanish beep as well. <coughs> it's fine. I know him. I know him. He's fine. Need to whack up the heating and not wear deodorant. <gasps> Right, this um, this is our first little trip. Well, that's the reverse noise, the crash. Yeah, actually feels nice and heavy. And look, the way it's steering, it's very, it is very coach-like. I like the way it's steering. Yeah, definitely. 
Yeah, I was trying to do the beep in Spanish, like beep, 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 beep. I was just, uh, that's more, that's an Italian reversing beep, isn't it? <laughs> nah, we don't drive fast here, we just, um, we just chill. We're driving a coach, I mean, you don't want to be getting on a day trip and, like, sitting there like that, do you? <laughs> Hello, and welcome aboard your bus. Your driver today is Game Tech UK. Or Juan, as we like to call him. Please make sure you sit in at least two metres apart. Yeah, slow and steady. Yeah. You shard gaming. <laughs> shard. Hello, Simon. How are you? Nah, it's not the same people that made um, Bus Sim, no. That's good bath, yeah. I think I'll, I think I'm gonna play it. Like I say, when I first started, there's no, um, there's no like, oh, this is coming to the channel. I'm just gonna play it and see if I fancy it, you know. <clears throat> yeah, we need bus racing in this one. Well, would it come to PlayStation Four? I'm, I'm suspicious that the answer could be yes, and the reason why, right? This is an old game. So it's almost, you know, Firm Bus is their main game. This was like a, a sort of a, a cut down version of Firm Bus. This is just the, hasn't got as many features as Firm Bus. So uh, it, it's always run quite lumpy. It's very system hungry. It's not very, um, it's not very uh, optimized. But three days ago, they released a beta um, for upgrading it to the new version of Unreal. Now that makes me think, okay, they maybe they just care about the game and they want to do that or have they seen the success that bus sim has had and maybe thought well let's have a look and see whether we can get this running on console we know the unreal engine can run on console um so yeah interesting interesting i'm not on the wrong side i'm on the right side yeah i have got gold rush actually yeah i do love a sim don't i Oh, we've got crews. That's it. We've got crews. <coughs> We're a coach. Why would we drive fast? It's not Grand Theft Auto, is it? It's a driving simulator. Hello, Need for Speed. Thank you, Paul. Yeah, love being here during these times, mate. Love it. And thank you for coming in, everyone. I do appreciate it. I'm really happy to have you here. Um, on this Tuesday, it's Tuesday today, isn't it? Um, feel free to leave me a little cheeky like. Uh, I do a lot on the channel, so if you are wanting entertainment, especially throughout lockdown, feel free to press the subscribe button. I'm back tonight as well with some Gran Turismo. We've got three hour race for. Oh my god, these roads! We've got three hour race for you. <laughs> yeah, now you shut up. <laughs> Get in there, coders. Uh, yeah, we've got three hour race for you on Gran Turismo tonight, so there's plenty going on the channel. Grand Theft Cochio. Oh, I love these tight, sort of, um, old Spanish roads. This is good. What, this one, Days, you mean, or the other bus simulator? Oh, this is a stop. We have to stop here. Okay. It feel It's making me in a good mood because it actually feels like a holiday destination. Thank you very much for subscribing. You get your name up on the screen as well. And who knows, you might like the other content I produce. I'm a very... It's variety gaming, right? It's variety. Tap dancing the lot. Yeah, they are nice, yeah. Why aren't the indicators working? They were working just a minute ago. Alright, this is our first... Um, this is our first stop. So at the moment I've got the doors on simple so they all open together but I can if I am going to enjoy the game <coughs> and play it more often then I'll set it all up on the button box and we can do everything. You can do things with a green circle, yeah yeah you can, you can, let's go and have a look at one. Um, where, where was the last one, where did we see it, it was just up here wasn't it? Oh you've left the search area, I better not, yeah I better not. Hello, uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed your journey here with Game Tech Travel. Get off your phone, mate. Enjoy your holiday. Look up, not down. <laughs> Honestly, some people. Alright, make sure that no one's left any binoculars or wallets or sun cream behind. 
<laughs> can you lean against the front of the... Yeah, you can, yeah, yeah. Different controls for different vehicles, yes, there is. Right, I think we've... Hang on a minute, hang on a minute. It's just there, isn't it? Oh, maybe we've got to go round the block? Yeah, okay, let's go round the block. See if it's going to take me around. Yeah, it's going to take me around. That's good. <coughs> it, it's, it feels very convincing, I think is the word. It does feel like a little Spanish island. Let's go and have a look at this. Let's just stop here. <laughs> right. Sorry, everyone. I, I won't be... Uh, oh, there's no one here. Who am I talking to? It's empty. What does this do? What does it do? This restaurant would be available as a sightseeing tour stop. It will improve your employees' satisfaction. Okay, so I think that's when we make our own um, routes. The actual traffic, everything looks good though, doesn't it? <laughs> it's it's Stavros, isn't it? Right, the indicators are working now. Strange. I think my favourite thing so far is these tight roads. Look, it's not just a case of flying around the map. You know, if you, well, you could do, I'm sure, if you want to play it like Grand Theft Auto, but what's the point? You might as well play Grand Theft Auto. When I play a game like this, I like to drive properly. You know, I, like, I want to compensate for this huge sort of coach we're driving around here. And you do see this when you go on holiday, didn't you? You do think, oh my god, how are they going to get that down there? But they always do, don't they? Yeah, it's the gradients as well, going up the hill. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Found a hotel. No, I actually like the bus sim map, the normal bus sim. I like it, but you, you only have to get something like this and immediately it shows it up, doesn't it? Because this is really interesting so far. This isn't just a case of, oh, oh, look, this is what I like. Look, you know, getting, you know, working your way through, checking your mirrors. I like that. I like that a lot. <laughs> Graham, I might clip that and put it in Discord. That was funny, wasn't it? Yeah, Bus Sim is good on, on Xbox, yeah, exactly. If they could get this um, working on console, wow, that would be really cool. What track? Bar first tonight. Right, this is a stop, so we have to stop here. It's the law. It doesn't compare to this, it doesn't compare to ATS. No, no, but it's a different game, isn't it? It's a different game. Yeah, it's got coaches, it's got lorries, whatever, but it, it's, it's different. This is very much... Um, I like these streets. I like them. Yeah, far more real than Bus Sim. And the actual environment is quite convincing. It really is. It makes me feel like I'm going on holiday, which is brilliant. We all need that at the moment, don't we? I like this, though. I like this bit in Bus Sim, actually. Just making sure that we can fit the bus through. So like I say, at the moment I've got the doors set up on simple, so to um, to open the doors at the moment you have to um, get out of your seat, which is fine, When I, if I decide that I'm going to play it for any length of time, I'll set all that up on the, uh, the button box so I can just sit in the driver's seat, open the door. It's the team version of me versus Codus tonight, yes, yeah. Yeah, it's just, mate, it's just, um, it's very interesting that after all this time, now they're deciding to upgrade this game to the very latest version of Unreal, which is very console friendly. You know, we've got a set of Corsa being used in that as well. Bus Sim uses, um, I don't think that uses the very latest version. So who knows? I mean, could they, could they be thinking of bringing this to console? It'd be a massive hit, wouldn't it? It would be a massive hit. And that maybe they've seen the success that Bus Sim have had and thought, well, let's see if we can get ours running. <coughs> All in Discord, Adrian. All in Discord. Let's go. Where are we going? Where are we go? Where are we going? Let's go and have a uh, hang on. Let's go and have a chat with everyone first. Hello, hello. <laughs> Does anyone want any water? They've always got free water, haven't they? Want some free? They just hand it out like it's nothing. Go on, have as much water as you want. We love water here. Right, let's go. Can you pimp the bus up? I think so. I think so. 
yeah, we don't know who's getting in the room tonight. Hopefully, Coffin, hopefully. We've got a massive garage back at the, um, yeah, free warm water, yeah. We've got a garage back at our base, so um, hopefully we can do loads of stuff, upgrade it. Very interested in that. See, I, you know, this is a stop sign. When I play this game, I want to play it properly. I don't want to just drive through. I want to stop, and that's just the way that I play. Uh, obviously, if you play, you might want to just fly through these, and that's totally fine. But what the... Come on, mate. You saw me pull out there. What are you waiting for? Wow. Sorry, everyone. Sorry, um, holiday makers. Wow. Yeah, I need a game tech skin, yeah. This is the bit I like, look, the gradients, tightness of taking a coach through roads that are just simply not designed for coaches, love it. What do you want a refund on, Simon? <laughs> but these games all get the, all get the same eye eye. Yeah, I suppose so, yeah, you're probably right, yeah. Yeah, the Unreal Engine does run on a uh, console, yeah, Bus Sim is in there, uh, there's loads of stuff, Unreal is a very, very console friendly game engine. Look at that little view, look, it's quite pretty, isn't it? Hello Banton, how are you? Yeah, the views are nice, aren't they? <coughs> Ferta Ventura, Spanish Island. Isn't it, Graham? Definitely a nice view, really nice. Scenery's detailed, yeah. yeah. And this isn't even on the highest setting either because it's poorly optimised, which it is. It's got a bad reputation for being poorly optimised. So even with the latest graphics, graphics card, you can't pump it up. But who knows what will happen. Maybe I'll download this uh, beta version and we can stream that and see if there's any difference in it that we can see. Yeah, definitely Luke, yeah. <laughs> the missus has put you on lockdown. I'm only allowed to watch one stream per month that contains a new... F <laughs> a new game or a bit of equipment. Don't worry. <laughs> It's fine, Mrs. Mad. He doesn't have to buy it. You sat in front of the oven for that <laughs> authentic holiday feel. Brilliant. Well, BT, I mean, there's no official confirmation of it. I've got my own rumours. I'm not starting rumours. I've got my own thoughts about it coming to PlayStation. So I'm, not, I'm certainly not starting rumours. But, um, yeah, maybe. It's very detailed, I've got to say. That there's a lot going on. It feels really real, doesn't it? And uh, and lived in, you know? Cool. Right, we're going back to the uh, the bus station, I presume. Uh, maximum, not, um, no, there's been no more news on that. Although that doesn't look a, um, a touch on this, does it? None of them do. This, this already is probably one of the best bus simulators I've seen. Uh, okay, I haven't been playing it long, but I've seen... You know, there's a lot going on, it seems quite detailed. I like the fact that you walk around, you go into your office, you get your, your computer, you've got your workshop. Um, I like the, the way that you can pick up passengers and drop them off. So far, so good, yeah. Yeah. As I say, that's only with what I've seen on YouTube and the hour that I've been playing here, but already it's, um, it's, it's interesting, it's cool. It's one of the Canary Islands, yeah. It says it's a Spanish island, Fort Aventura. I think it is Canary Islands, though. I don't know why it wants me to go this way, though. Look, look on the on the sat nav. It wants me to go this way, but last time we went in there. Okay. Yeah, hopefully, Lee. I mean, there's got to be a reason, isn't there? There's got to be. Re Maybe you've got to um, employ mechanics as well, because I think to start with, you have to send your um, mechanics. You know your. Um, uh, mechanical problems, you have to outsource them. Yeah, I'm not sure though, no, because the orange, uh, the dark orange, said come up here. 
Yeah, you, oh, you do as well, unpopular, yeah, yeah. And of course, this is a second hand bus as well. Yeah, this is second hand. I think you can, Andrix, from what I'm seeing. I like the way the bus leans as well. I would like that authentic, um, I don't know if any of you watched my stream the other day where I put a coach in Euro Truck. You know that sort of suspension noise? I'd like it to have that, yeah. Oh, nice one, Scud. <laughs> a, a new bus simulator, wow, okay. Um, where are we actually going? Is it, it's here. Oh, we've got to go all the way around, I see. Yeah, okay. What's the horn like? You are picky. What, me, Steve? What do you mean? Explain yourself. <laughs> Pathetic horn. That's not the first time it's been said to you, is it, Jason? <laughs> yeah, ETS, ETS has not been dropped. <coughs> One, I did the 24-hour stream. <coughs> oh, new and persistent cough. Um, two, I'm waiting for the end of the month. There's no point putting any miles in now. Once the new new month comes, then uh, we'll uh, start it again and we'll see if we can get to first, eh? <coughs> Right, let's get in here. <laughs> Rear beepers, air suspension, whatever next. Oh, of course I'm picky, Steve. Of course I am. I want I want the best in gaming. I, want, I like detail. You know, I'm not a graphics whore. I'm not a whore at all. I'm not a graphics whore. I'm a detail whore. I like that extra level of immersion. Hi. Uh, uh, hi, yeah, how you doing? Uh, I like that, you know? Yeah, like the door sounds, it's got that, yeah. No, there doesn't sh seem to be any luggage showing, which is a real shame. That is such a shame, and it would be good if you could put it on a trolley. It would be good. So the AI, yeah, they come out and they disappear, and they glitch into each other. we just got to accept that, haven't we? we just got to accept that. Spray shop, yeah, I've got your coffin, yeah. No, but you can do that yourself manually, Steve, don't worry, there's buttons for that. I've got, at, at the moment, um, I've got everything on simple. So door opening, um, starting up at the bus, everything is on simple. And I thought I'd leave it like that. If I decide that I want to play it, or if it's something that I want to bring to the channel on a more permanent basis, then I'll set everything up on control schemes. So yeah, you can bend, you can lean the bus, you can open all the doors and luggage individually, you can get in, start the bus, all that sort of stuff. Yeah, all that. Right, okay, let's follow the route. Let's do it. Bib, bib, oh, 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 it was a door closing. Bib, 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 I'm doing a Spanish reversing beach there. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Yeah, and obviously I'll shoot lovely people as well if you'd like to see more of it, you know. I think if you like normal bus sim, which uh, it is Italian, yeah. I think uh, a lot of people here like my normal bus sim content. So I'm sure that we can uh, make some fun out of this. I'm sure we can. Oh, actually, it's this way, isn't it? Gaza, it's too late. I have given up my day job to do this. <laughs> <laughs> Bibba, Bibba, Bibba. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry if you are new and you've come into this and you're thinking, oh, what is he doing? What is he doing? Right, let's go. <laughs> Apologise, yeah. If it comes out, Maxim, yeah, of course, yeah. Don't you, oh my god, me. At the moment, it's not mentioning fuel, which is interesting. So, um, yeah. Oh, nice one, Pete. You can go back to clapping now, can't you? <laughs> yeah, Andrew, if you search my channel, there's lots of farming sim on the channel. Right, so we're going to our next stop then, I presume.
Yeah, he's gonna clap. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, there are fuel stations. Yeah, yeah, there are fuel. So hopefully, I mean, you'd think a coach would have maybe a, a fuel station at the actual base, wouldn't you? Or, or separate to a normal garage? I mean, do you see coaches in garages? I suppose you do. I didn't say I didn't like Russian. What are you talking about, Klein? Are you crazy? Why is the indicators not working? Sometimes they work, sometimes they don't. Are you crazy? Oh, he's been timed out. Oh, bloody hell. It's, it's, uh, it's lockdown, and then no one's getting away with nothing. <laughs> yeah, this is Tourist Bus Simulator. It's on the PC. I had my own suspicions about it coming to console, um, but it's not official. <clears throat> Indicate if you can be asked, yeah, yeah. Yeah, what I'll do is, uh, oh, we're going, oh, we're just dropping off here. This is where we live, isn't it? Okay. Italian and they're offended. I oh, got you. Yeah, this game reminds me of when you used to be able to go out and do stuff. Yeah, I think that's why it's put me in a right good mood. It feels, um, it feels like I'm on holiday. So as I say, we have got um, the controls on simple. So if I am going to continue playing this game, I can set up loads of buttons to lean the bus, open the front door, the back door, all the different doors. At the moment, I've got it set up on simple. So all you need to do is just jump out of your seat and it, and it all happens that way. But um, they've left... Oh, this is where we left luggage. Oh, God. That's a little bit weird. I'd like them to somehow... I don't know how, but take their luggage would be really good but I suppose that's just asking too much isn't it yeah the mountain looks awesome and the representation of the coach as well obviously it's man M -A -N or man however you say it so it must be licensed so it's all got to be exactly oh sorry oh go on mate go on hola it's got to <laughs> it's got to be all properly represented hello sweetheart you alright Go on, geezer. Go go down the beach. Oh, mirrored sunglasses. Yeah, I know what you're up to. Your first trip. Return to the company. Okay, let's go. It does, It has got a real look. Yeah, it has. It has got a real look. <laughs> yep, indicators still aren't working. Very strange. What do you think in the in the chat? Let me know. Chuck in your thoughts. I'll read them out. What do you think? This is going to get tight round. See, this is where it's going to get interesting. It wants me to go down. It wants me to go round there. But I mean, how am I going to get round there realistically? I don't. How am I going to get round there? That's going to be quite an ask, isn't it? I'm not sure about that. I know it's got night time. I'm not sure if it's got dynamic. Is it? Is it? Is it a vote? Yeah. Okay, let's try and get round here like this. Okay, so this is going to have to be a curb jobby, isn't it? It's fine though, it's fine. You do see this, don't you? You know, the coaches, they just have to get on with it, don't they? I don't think this this bus has uh, got rear steer. I'm still up on the curb, look. <laughs> Come on, I need to go out. I'm still up on the curb. Let me out. 14th of um, next month, Andrew. Hello, Maxine. Can you download Steam on Chromebook? I should think so, Dean. Would you be able to run any games on Chromebook? I doubt it. <coughs> How are you, son? Do you want to do your old dad a cup of tea? See, it's good having kids home from school. Go on. You do this cup of tea? <laughs> yeah, it's hard. TT Oliver Man is hard. Yeah, they've got two. Right, go on in. Go and make this cup of tea. Thanks, mate. 
Have I killed any bikers today? No, not today. Not today. Yeah, you know, it's like a cooking lesson, isn't it? You know? Yeah, this would be really tough for uh, racing. But there's so much detail. Look, bits of um, uh, rubbish everywhere. You know, like tennis courts. I mean, I can't believe, actually, how much how much actual detail there is. It'd be nice if it just run a little bit better. But that's what the beta's about. And I will bring the beta, actually. Maybe during the week, I'll download the beta and um, see how much better it's running. Max is a lovely kid, yeah. That's good, Enable. That's good. I like it. I like bringing you new games. I'm not new games. I know this isn't new. I'm on the camera. But uh, I know it is really cool. Ah. You can get out and everything. Let's get in here. Enter your... Uh... <laughs> click on... Oh, okay. Yeah, we've got this. Oh, we've got a folder to click on. I know. It's cool, isn't it? Employees. Click on this button to open the job market. Then click on an applicant. You can negotiate the monthly salary. Um, we'll employ oh, drivers, mechanics, guides, job market. Here we go. Um, Lenny Lenny Schwan. Let's pay him one. <laughs> Let's pay him one euro. <laughs> he wasn't satisfied. Okay, that's fine. <coughs> Custard creams, yeah, definitely. Um, he's twenty nine. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Eight hundred. Yeah. Let's go. Eight hundred euros. Come on. Come on. Do it. Do it. No. Oh wow. When it's, um, like out, yeah. He wants fourteen hundred. Oh. Let's go nine hundred. It said I can negotiate. So. Bosh. <laughs> Accepted my offer. I didn't give him one. It be I work tomorrow. Okay. He's been doing school work. I got him doing school work the second he got up today, eight didn't I? Eight o'clock in the morning. Eight, eight o'clock. I'm like, right, I'm going to be streaming at 11, which I, I, I don't... I was mega, mega. <laughs> I said, I'm going to be streaming at 11. I'm quite happy for you to play your games while I'm uh, playing, while I'm streaming. But I want you doing homework now. Eight o'clock, he was on it. Go and get that tea, Max. Right, okay. Go to the gulag, yeah. Where? I wonder where I was. I'm like, I'm in it. I'm in a cupboard. I'm in a cupboard. <laughs> uh, what, what did Dean say? Sorry. Yeah, can you download Steam on a Chromebook? I did say to you, yes, I'm sure you can. But would you run a game like this or any Steam-related games? Probably not. Um, oh, yeah, okay. So we've got to skip time to tomorrow. Uh, just there, I presume. Your new employee has arrived and is now available. Get a new order again. Uh, where do we get our orders? The fax machine, isn't it? Okay, so <clears throat> so there's a new order. Current orders, completed, completed orders, but we've got another one. That's the same one, isn't it? Yeah, it's the same one. Okay, let's do that. Go to the pin board to open the schedule. Oh my god, there's a lot going on here, isn't there? In the schedule, you can manage your routes. Click on an entry, will show you the route on the map. In the entry, click on the button in the right field to assign a driver and a vehicle. Okay. So at the moment, oh look at this, look. Oh, this is the island. Yeah. So these are all. This is the island. Yeah. This is this is the island we're on basically. <coughs> oh, be careful, Max. Careful, mate. <laughs> Don't spill it. It's a room full of electronics. Don't spill it. Oh, that's good, Max. You've been there, yeah? Right. I got it. Right, go on and go and have a play, and then we're back, back to homework soon. Thanks, Max. Oh, that's really hot. Oh! Right, go and play, Max. Make the most of it. Okay. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Go on, carry on, mate. Go and make the most of it, and then back to school work. You shut the door, please, Max. Trip services. Oh, here you go. Here. Okay. So, um, click on an entry, change driver. Okay, so there's me or there's Tamina. We're gonna click, gonna click that and se select the vehicle. Okay, so I think I've told Tamina, whoever that is. Yeah, thanks, Max, and they clear off. Yeah, 
Uh, Max is doing Fortnite with his friends. Yeah, they're playing some competitive mode or something, you know. <clears throat> is Max doing school over the internet? Not school over the internet as such. The, the teacher's just going, go on, do that, do that, do that, do that. So he's like, oh, for God's sake. He's got a lot of homework, a lot. Right, I think I think we've assigned my bus, that driver, to that route. I don't know how that's going to affect me and what I'm going to have to do. But uh, let's see what it says. Open the calendar again and skip two days forward, because that's when it starts. <clears throat> two days, so we'll go to the 7th. A bus driver of your company needs your vehicle for an order. Do you want to return the vehicle? Oh, yeah, because I've got it at the moment. Yeah, okay, yes, I want to return it to him. Oh, it's raining. It's raining! The order has been successfully completed by your employee. Now open the fleet management in the vehicles menu. There's loads of stuff here. Where's the vehicles menu? That's the inventory. Oh, look at this. You can fill up on your coach for for selling stuff. Oh, I like this. This is quite advanced, isn't it? There's a lot going on here. Um, now open the fleet management. Where is the fleet management? <coughs> Is it is it there? That's vehicles. Is it in here? No, that's employees. What's that? Statistics. Yeah, this is cool. Maybe fix your indicators. Yeah, I think that's a bit glitchy. Yeah. Where is fleet management? Normally you have a little blue arrow. It's not outside, is it? Oh, look at that. That's nice. Nice rain as well. Look, everything's a little bit damp. I love this room. I can't wait to see the bus in there. This is going to be cool. Can we go up there as well? Oh, check that out. Check that out. Look at this. Bus repair. Look. Cool. There's quite a bit of stuff here, isn't it? In a way, it sort of reminds me of... Oh, it's raining inside. I need to get that fixed, don't I? I need to get that fixed. Oh, dear. That's not going to be good. That's a health and safety hazard. In a way, it reminds me of something like Car Mechanic Sim. Um... Yeah, it might be Kodish. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Might be right. Yeah, yeah. Right. The orders been... now open the fleet management in your vehicles menu. <coughs> That's vehicles. Your employee did use the vehicle for the previous order. Yeah, the option is only available. Okay, let's continue. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, GT Tours. Okay, let's just go GT UK. Let's do it. Oh, it won't let me do it. Get out of it. Why Why not? Does it need a number? Oh, it does. Okay. G <laughs> GT UK number one. Okay. It said fleet management, though, didn't it? It said fleet management in your vehicle. Buy a vehicle, okay. We don't want to sell it or anything. We don't need components. It wasn't asking us to do that, was it? What was it asking us to do? The icon said fleet. Okay, this. Fleet, fleet. Well, oh, fleet, okay, yeah. Oh, this is the fleet, okay. Ah, tick that. It becomes, it comes back to me. Okay, I think that's what it is, yeah. Yeah, the permanent order. Get a new order for yourself. So I think I've decided to use the bus now. Yeah, it's soaked. Look, it's raining out here. Look at this. Right, so go and get a new order. <clears throat> oh, there are orders which persist permanently. These are marked with a special symbol. So we want something uh, permanent to um, build our company on, don't we? So let's go to new orders. That's a permanent one because it's got that little icon there. Um, so yeah, it's uh, to Casalus de Angel. <laughs> we left that. Okay, that's fine. Reopen the schedule, which was up, and assign yourself a vehicle. It was up here, wasn't it? Schedule. That's it. <coughs> it's this one, and we want to do Jason, which is me, and that, and tick that. Okay. 
Open the calendar, move it forward. There's quite a few, quite a bit of clicking, isn't there? There's that one. Move it forward to there. Infinity symbol for you. Is it bitumen? Is it? <laughs> right, follow the route. Okay. It stopped raining. Thank God. Although I wanted to see the the wiper effect. I wanted to see it. I like the sound. Sounds good. Yeah, it's cool. I think this is a management sim a lot more than just driving, yeah, which I think is a good thing, isn't it? I mean, again, we're not slagging off bus sim. It's, a, it's like when I play a set of Corsa and suddenly I start talking about the limitations of Gran Turismo. Um, bus simmy that's got a bit of management, isn't it? But it, it really does boil down to the fact you buy a bus, you buy, you get a person, and they go off and do their thing. This definitely has got more management, without a doubt, which uh, not everyone will like. Absolutely, not everyone will like that. Some people just like the driving. Um, no, it closes. It all closes as you go. Like I say, at the moment, I've got everything on simple, so the doors are all very simple, but you can control them individually. You can make the bus lean. Um, yeah, sounds are really good. Yeah, definitely. But what I will do is I will download this beta version of the improvements in the engines, so and I'll stream that and we'll see how we get on with that. Indicators are working now. I wonder if it is uh, such a thing as like things are a little bit faulty. Go on, mate, you get round there. What are you waiting for? Come on. I think my favourite aspect of the game so far, outside of things like the graphics and the sound, <coughs> is the fact that we've got a drive down... It's a real varied map, isn't it? We've been on sort of sort of motorways, and then all of a sudden you're driving up an incline around a little old-fashioned high street, but you've still got the same size coach and all the uh, limitations you've got. So I like that. So far, that is... Uh, it keeps it interesting, doesn't it? Hello, Big J. How are you? Good to talk to you last night. Press said, yes, we've got to do the... Yeah, that's it. Yeah, here we go. Thank you, um, uh, Philip. You can hit the curb without being fined. Yes, yeah. But it's fine, I'm not having a go at um, Bus Sim, you know I love it, I lo that's why I'm playing this, because I like that game. I think so far the, the graphics and the amount of detail is an absolute winner. It really does actually feel quite convincing that you're on this sort of Spanish island. And we've only just seen a little bit of the island, so, you know, there's going to be there's gonna be more to see. Yeah, it was fun, wasn't it? I'm sure it is Papa's, but this is the one I'm playing right now. Yeah, Snow Run is going to be epic, and certainly one that I'm going to be playing. 154 likes. Thank you very much, everyone. I do appreciate it. Um, I'm enjoying entertaining you, hopefully, throughout this um, lockdown. Loads of streams happening. Uh, that's cool. Look, all that sort of stuff. Uh, daily streams, couple of times a day, um, so feel free to subscribe. You never know, you might like it. If you don't, you can always unsubscribe later on. I can't say fairer than that. Don't seem to be a lot of cats. There are always cats everywhere, aren't there? Where I go in Turkey, it's not cats, it's dogs. Dogs everywhere, and I love them. Absolutely love them. There's no cats. There's literally stray dogs everywhere. And they're so friendly. They, they, they're very clever as well. They give you the old doughy eyes when you're eating and eating outside and that. They know what they're doing. Hello, Sam. How are you? Yeah, I will do, Coffin. I will do. I have got Firm Boss. I just haven't played it. I like the idea of this being smaller than Firm Boss, Alex, to be honest with you. Um, that's, uh, and I like the holiday destination thing. Yeah, it, um, it tempted me more, but I have got Fern Bus as well. Fern Bus, I think, is more, even more involved. Like, for example, when people get on your bus, I think in Fern Bus, you have to correct me, Alex, I think you have to make sure that they're on the right bus. You check their tickets and you have to make sure. With this, I think they just get on and off automatically once you stop there. But I think Fern Bus is a little bit different. You'll have to correct me if I'm wrong, Alex. Are the 
there any trains on the island at Fuerteventura? That's why I, I want to see a train. I don't know why I want to see a train. Would there be trains on an island? No, there wouldn't be, would there? Does anyone know the answer to this? Would there be would there be any trains? Oh, Gun Corps, thank you very much, mate. It's very generous of you. You don't have to do that. I appreciate that. And a bridge, yeah, definitely. I'm sure there's bridges, but would there be a train on an island like this? Oh, there's trains in the island, man. There's trains on the island. Why? Yeah, I don't know. Easy, it's not bus turismo, yeah. Thank you, Gun Corps, thank you. I don't think we actually need to go up to them to discover them. Look, this is this is the bit I like. Coming up here, look, being careful not to hit anyone. I like that engine sound as well. Yeah, no worries, Jay. All good, mate. My pleasure. Uh, yeah, you do have to check them on a firm bus later on in tourist bus sim. You have to do the same. Oh, awesome, Alex. That's good. That's good. So, yes, I'm a slow driver, but when I play a sim game, I wouldn't call it role playing. I don't do role playing, but I do sort of role playing with the vehicle. I want to drive it properly. I don't want to just slam it around. I like to stop at every traffic light, every um, stop sign. It's just the way that I like to do it. Um, I think it I think it makes the game better personally and hopefully it makes a better stream as well you don't want to just see me driving like it's Grand Theft Auto I like to drive it properly <laughs> yeah Vin yeah <laughs> come on ladies and gentlemen get on now I am Juan I am the b s speed up love speed up quick you're gonna die look at you <laughs> right let's see uh, let's see what this uh, kitty cup of tea is like Hola. Mm. Hola, twins. How are you? Hello. Hello, mate. Well, Max, there's officially no, right? But I've got my own suspicions that, and I will explain it just in case you've just come in. This is quite an old game, right? Tourist bus, it's old, it's been on PC for absolutely ages. <clears throat> Hasn't really had any huge updates. Three days ago, there was a new beta for this game, um, updating it all to the latest version of the Unreal Engine. Well, the latest version of the Unreal Engine is very, very console friendly. We've got a set of Corsa Competition coming. That's built in there. Bus Sim is obviously, I don't think Bus Sim is the latest version of the Unreal Engine. So that's got me thinking, why are they, why are they revisiting this game? Could it be that they've seen the success that Bus Simulator has had on the console and they might, uh, rightly so, think, hang on, we, we can do better than that. Could it mean it's coming to console? Officially, no. I'm not starting any rumours. I'm just talking out loud. But who knows? Who knows? Wouldn't it be great? Wouldn't it be great if this could come to console? This would, uh, this would be absolutely epic. What it would look like, I don't know. How it perform, I don't know. I don't know why you'd want to race around on a game like this. Yeah, exactly. Uh, but you do get a few comments. Oh, drive faster. Oh, drive faster. Drive. <coughs> and obviously some of the routes... Um, <laughs> competition. <laughs> some of the routes are going to be um, long. Some of them are. Some of them are going to be short. I mean, it's all good. Hello, Jack. Yeah, very well. Thank you very much. I like the way we really have to compensate. I think probably more than bus sim. Um, you have to really compensate for the size of your vehicle. And that I do like. That is a big... Um, I'd like to speed this up, by the way, but you can't. You can with a mouse, but obviously with a mouse it sort of becomes a little bit clunky. I like the fact that you can use, on the TGT, I've got two analogue um, sticks. But you can't speed it up. I've put it to the uh, maximum speed. See you later, Philip. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, they, you know, as a developer, they must have seen the success and the, the desire that Bus Sim brought with, um, on console, and they must have thought, they must have thought to themselves, can we bring this game to console? They must have done. So the fact that there's a new beta out for a brand new update on the uh, Unreal Engine, I don't know. It's making me, it's making me, it's making me think it could happen. So what I'll do is, I will, during the week, I will download this beta 
and see if it runs better, performs well, any new features it's got, and I'll stream that, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's good, Pivers. I'm always honest with my games. People say to me, oh, would you rate it out of 10? Uh, you know, if if you don't know me, my rating is irrelevant to you, isn't it? Like, if I went, oh, this is a 9, but you got to know the reviewer, haven't you? And if you do watch my streams, then I talk out loud about everything, and I don't really do scores. If you've watched, then you know my thoughts, and we've shared it in the chat. That's the way I like to do it. You know, people go in to, you know, what's your score? Well, I don't even know you. You've never been in before. What if I say it's a 10? You might not think it's a 10, but that's why I like to chat about the game more than just chuck a score on it. I think it's more important. Um, you know, it's like um, chatting about a film rather than saying, oh, can you score that film for me? Seven. Oh, I'll go and see it. you got to talk about things, haven't you, you know? And we go by Jason's oohs and ahs. I only give bridges scores, yeah, I want to see a bridge in this game. They're called Aerosoft? Airsoft? Yeah, yeah, they, they do firm bus. They do quite a few simulators, so they know their stuff. And they've obviously made a lovely little game here. A really good idea, actually. The fact of making it just on an island, I like that. And you're taking tourists around as well. I want most games you show, but not got a PC. That's all right. That's why I like to do a mixture of um, PC and console. You know, for that reason, I don't want to block everyone out that's got a console, and I don't want it to become a PC master race channel. And I like console anyway. I love my PlayStation. Absolutely love it. I've got an Xbox, but I don't really play Xbox. Doesn't mean I'm an Xbox hater. Max is on the Xbox right now. It's, it's the it's the console that's underneath the TV. The PlayStation is in my gaming room, so uh, that's the one <coughs> that gets the most um, most uh, play, and I like the games on it, you know, I like Gran Turismo and The Last of Us, so I'm mostly PlayStation 4, admittedly. Can you see this game doing better than Bus Sim if it comes to console? Yeah, because I think it's a more, it's certainly a more complex game. Um, yeah, it's definitely more complex, yeah. Yeah, see you later, Gunko. Thank you, mate. You're very generous. I appreciate that. <coughs> now, I'm going to do another family quiz. I'm going to do another one, but I'm not going to do... Um, I'm not going to use Kahoot. I'm going to I'm going to present it in a sort of digital way. The, the, the questions are going to be on the screen. I'm going to be reading them out. But you have to follow along with pen and paper and mark it yourself. That's the only way we can stop trolls ruining it. Because um, I was really, really up for that. I spent all day preparing. <coughs> all day for preparing for that stream. And then when he started spamming the thing, it was just ridiculous. So I want to do another quiz because I thought it was a good idea and it was nice. Everyone was getting together. But I'll present it in a digital way. I won't just sit there and read the bloody questions out. I will present it very similar to Hacker Who is. But your end, you'll be... Um, yeah. Oh, Jason can hardly hear you over the coach. Oh, is that is that right for anyone else? I can turn that down, is that is that the case? Because I did turn it up, didn't I? Sounds okay. Okay, I'll turn it down a little bit though, yeah. Sounds all good. I'll turn it down a little bit, I didn't realise it was loud, I do apologise. Just a little bit, okay. Okay, well that should be better. Thank you, Warrior, for uh, mentioning that. Yeah, so I do want to do another quiz, and uh, yeah, it just it might just be pen and paper your end, but it doesn't matter if you're playing along. You know, you're playing along, aren't you? You know. No, ball hello, Baldin. Uh, no, it is uh, Fur Adventura. It's based on that. Yeah, sorry, Warrior. Uh, yeah, okay. I didn't um, didn't know it was like that. I do apologise um, if you've just come in and it was a bit loud. I've just turned it down. So we're starting, this is Tourist Bus, we're starting to see a little bit more of the island now. Looks more like Las Vegas at the moment. <laughs> Hello Sean, how are you? Yeah Shane, there's loads of um, Euro Truck on the channel. 
Oh, I like these little towns. Here we are. We've got to stop up here. We've got to stop. It looks good, Leon. Yeah, you're talking about this one, yeah? Yeah, it looks it, it it's um it definitely runs a little bit lumpy. It's not the, the best organized um or optimized game, but it's working, certainly working. Yeah, you too, warrior. Right, ladies and gentlemen, I am your driver for the day. Get on there. Get on there and get off there. Hello, sweetheart. Oh, look at this one. Look. Oh, hello. <laughs> I am the perfect driver. A <laughs> blue shirt. No, we're not doing blue shirt. Hola. Uh, and they do, um, they do disappear, which is a bit weird, but it's fine. <laughs> Put the gloves on. But there just seems to be so much detail. There seems to be so many... They, they thought of... It's one of the most detailed maps I've seen for a game like this. Let's go to the mini-mart. Oh, you can buy stuff here. Look at this. Oh, that's for water then, is it? Okay. Yeah, let's buy, let's buy loads of water. Let's buy that. What happens to it? Okay, I don't know where the water goes, but that's fine. You can buy stuff. Let's go and have a look at the restaurants as well, across the road carefully. I mean, it does actually feel like a little holiday. You can imagine going on holiday here, can't you? You really can. <laughs> the restaurant is available as a sightseeing tour. So I think when we go... Oh, so 2 out of 48. So you have got to go up to them, I think. It's fine driving past them, but I think you have to actually go up to them to fully discover them. Discover, sorry. Discover? Discover them. Okay, let's get back, because they're starting to worry about me. <laughs> they're thinking, where, where, where's Juan gone? Where's Juan gone? Nice one, Warrior. Yeah, we're doing well, mate. Right, next destination, let's go. Very detailed, isn't it? Very oh, we've got a... Oh, now we've got a um, reverse camera. I wonder if Codus is right, because sometimes it feels a little bit dodgy, like the indicators work, then they don't. I wonder if it is because it is a second-hand um, coach, and it's just a bit... It needs, it needs sorting. What are you laughing at? Oh, I wonder if Codus is right. <laughs> yeah, and reverse beach. Yeah, yeah, I haven't got to do the, you know. Yeah, the supermarket thing is what ETS needs. It would be good, wouldn't it? Oi, come on. We're on, we're on holiday here. Yeah? Is he right? Oh, Codus is right again. Don't believe it, honestly. Hello, Aaron. How are you? This is the game when you can't go on holiday. Yeah? Hopefully you're all enjoying it. If you are, please leave me a little cheeky like. Don't forget to subscribe because I'm streaming all the time now. While we're on lockdown, I'm streaming at least twice a day. Um, variety stuff as well. It's not all sim. It is a bit of everything. It's not all PC. There's console as well. Feel free to subscribe. Hopefully you'll like it. Um, but yeah, if not, just feel free to get involved in the chat. We've got a lovely bunch of people here. We're a great little gaming community. It's like the M1, I know. This is why I left the UK. <laughs> Cheaper taxes and no traffic. Come on. <laughs> At least twice a day now. Yeah, I'm trying to stream as much as I can. To give you as much potential enjoyment as possible. Obviously, you, you know, it is a variety channel. So some of my streams you just won't be interested in. That's fine. But you come into the ones that you are. I love people that do that. Yeah, yeah. I think, uh, I mean, let's be honest, right? I love Bus Sim. I, I followed it from the very, very start, didn't I? And I've made videos on pretty much every single option in Bus Sim. But 
uh, you know, being objective, this is better than bus sim. There's no doubt. Uh, tell me what you think in the chat. With a simple yes or no, we love a vote. Do you think that from what you've seen so far, I'm not asking you to slag off bus sim. I'm just saying, I think this game is better than bus sim. What do you think in the chat? Yeah, it is a vote. Just a yes or no. I'm interested in what you think. It ain't just about what I think. It's about what you think as well. Just a yes or no. Just a yes or no. Do you think this is better than bus sim? I think it's just genuinely better, isn't it? It's, 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 it's obvious, isn't it? Doesn't mean that there's anything wrong with bus sim. It doesn't mean that I won't play bus sim. It's just a, a gamer's opinion. I think this is better than bus sim. It's got far more going for it. Um, yeah, and uh, I really like it. And wow, if this could come to console, that would be absolutely epic. It really would. Yeah. Doesn't mean that we're <laughs> spoil spoil ballot. Doesn't mean that we're having a go at bus sim. It doesn't mean that I'm not looking forward to the new um, DLC that's coming. It's just an honest conversation, which uh, in, in gaming and YouTube channels as well, I think is definitely missing. There's not there's not enough honest conversations going on in gaming. But I like to have a good old chat. And if something's true, it's true. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter if it's right. It's right. Definitely pretty here, yeah, yeah, without a doubt. And obviously games that are based on a real location generally come out on top as well, don't they? You know, if you, and, and real, real vehicles as well. If you can get a game that's based on somewhere or modelled on somewhere, it generally works better, doesn't it? That's what I find anyway. You just pulling out there, are you, mate? It's not Autobahn Simulator, is it? Oh my god, that was terrible. Whew. Can you get keys for the new DLC uh, for Bus Sim? Um, what do you mean, can I? What, to give out? Someone, it wasn't you who messaged me on bloody um, Steam last night, was it? I got a message on Steam. I just started playing this, funnily enough. And, uh, oh, hi, Game Tech. You're the best. Oh, all right, how you doing? Yeah, yeah, cool. Can you send me Grand Theft Auto and Bus Simulator, please? I'm like, what do you mean, send? You went, just give it to me. I'm a YouTube channel, not a free game shop. Honestly, you know, some people, you know, just straight in. Can you send me Grand Theft Auto and bus sim? I mean, what, what do they think? I've just got codes hanging out of me. It's crazy, isn't it? It's so crazy. Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> oh, Microsoft Flight Sim is gonna. I, I mean, I've set aside a corner of my room with a flight rig. I'm waiting for Microsoft Flight Sim. Yeah, it's going to be very, very good. Yeah, just straight in there. Straight in there. I've been playing for games all this time. Yeah, can you send me a PlayStation 5? I don't know. I mean, I do give away, so maybe maybe that's why they think I'm just sitting on codes. But, I mean, you can't request codes, can you? You know? Right, this is the bit I like. The fact that, no, you got you have actually got to go quite slow round here the map is made in such a way along with the physics that there's no way you could speed round there even if you actually wanted to you'd crash Harrison what are you spamming for you don't need to keep doing double unless it's accidental I think you said that the other day that it was accidental which I don't believe for a second can you pay me my wages for the next three months only 80% of them coders <laughs> yeah can you send me your gloves your boots and your motorcycle that was uh, Arnie, just in case anyone's wondering. <laughs> no, you're not having pedals. No, you're not having my pedals. I haven't got any racing skills. Oh, are we back? Is this back home? I recognise this already. No, it's not. No, it's not. I thought it was. Oh, skid. We're not home just yet. The buses feel a lot larger than they do in something like Euro Truck and Bus Simulator as well. You're really getting a sense of um, of how big it is. Let me just go and have a look. It says we've we've discovered a hotel, but I think we actually um, I think we need to go up to it. Oh, sorry, mate, I was straight on you there. I think we need to go up to it to fully discover it. 
Yeah, it's more real stew, yeah. This hotel can offer shuttle services to you and may accept your sightseeing tours. Okay, so we can work for hotels. Yeah, one out of 20. I think we actually have to go up to this stuff. I've already done that loads of times, Senny. It's not about just free codes here. Because um, otherwise you get the wrong people in. You know, where's my code? Where's my code? And then they sod off, you know? Um, yeah, it's not... I, I've given away probably about... 15 copies of bus sim probably about the same of truck driver they don't want to keep giving them to me because otherwise it devalues the you know the 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 value of the actual product because in the end you just hang around for free codes and they want to buy it so it's business as well isn't it at the end of the day it's business they want to give me a free codes when it come out which was great i don't want to keep asking for codes you know yeah, there is day and night, yeah, and there is weather as well. I don't know if it's dynamic, though. I don't know if it's like you go out of your um, your office and suddenly it's raining or dark. I don't know if it's dynamic. <coughs> yeah, free code's all right, but uh, it's not the be-all and end-all. I like it, though. I like it a lot. Yeah, it's cool. It's, it's, it, it just feels different. Oh, nice one, Codus. Get on it, mate. Get on it. We won't see him for a week now. Yeah, you don't need any practice for tonight. It's fine. Codus, uh, is that John on the bench? What? Where? 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 I'm just looking for wicker furniture. <laughs> Do a toilet roll giveaway. Yeah. Just watch the member stream from yesterday. Did you watch it towards the end, Nathan? Because that drawing game we did wasn't that good. But when we got into Quiplash, it was, uh, it was epic. Behind me. Is that John? It looks like he's asleep. Oh no, he's on his phone. John! Oh, John! John! I thought we heard me then. <laughs> no, he's controlling that phone with um, far too much confidence. That wouldn't be him. <coughs> Coda stole the show. Yes, he did, yeah. Now, um, no, Snowy, you can't. But you can get Fernbus, which is their main program, or their main game. And uh, I think that's got more stuff with it. Right, should we try and do... Should we try and do a three-point... Not a three-point turn, but a U-turn. There's no one coming, so... And this is the sort of thing you see Spanish drivers doing, isn't it? They, they don't care, do they? They just think, well, you shouldn't have built a hotel there, then. No controller? No, there is controller support. Support, Absolutely there is, you know. Yeah, I can show you in the menu. Everything is based for controller. Yeah. Because I think you can use the controller to um, actually walk around as well. But you can reassign everything. Yeah. Well, don't quote me on that. But I know it's got controller support. Because I started playing it with a controller. But, you know, don't take my word for it. Yeah, rear view cam is still hit and miss. I wonder if Codus is right. <laughs> Hello, mate. Go on, get on there. Oh, hello, sweetheart. You look like you've been dragged through a bloody bush backwards, sweetheart. Get in there. What's this? Look at them all, look. There's just one bird in here Boy. as well. Oh, an old granny, look. Oh, hello. Boy. Hello, love. <laughs> and you can go everywhere, look. Look at this, look. Pity there's not little collectibles. I'd love that. Oh my god, that would make it perfect for me. I'm sure there are. Oh, oh no, don't walk into that. If you ever see them on holiday, just do yourself a favour. Don't walk into them. Don't. There are, are they? Oh, okay, yeah, that's what I want to look for. I love looking for stuff like that. That That is gaming to me. It's really detailed though, isn't it? I want to go to a bar. I actually just want to stop, sit outside, watch the traffic go past, uh, and have like a, oh, I don't know, like a... I don't know, like a full English? <laughs> you know, be proper, feel like you're on proper holiday in another country and go for a proper full English. Then we've got all local produce. Look at this, look. There's loads of details here, isn't it? I've lost my coach, but it don't matter. It doesn't matter. I think I probably do like this more than Bus Simulator. Yeah, it doesn't mean I don't like Bus Simulator. Oh, look at the bike as well, look. Very cyber truck, isn't it? <laughs> So Jim uh, it will improve that, 1 out of 11. So I think you actually have to go up to stuff. It's got lovely detail, John, isn't it? Yeah, lovely detail. Really is cool. 
Do AI buses drive around? I haven't seen another one just yet. A uh, gym on holiday? I know. <laughs> yeah, all right. All right, mate. This one's being done up. I mean, look at the crazy amount of detail. This is actually quite impressive. Uh, you can find cash and collectibles in ran random shipping containers. Okay, that's cool. So we've got to be in here with um, with a coach. On. Oh, yeah, so you can refuel. Yeah, you can. Any ash? Whoa, mate, leave off. I'm on holiday here. Yeah? You get that on holiday, don't you? When you go out for a walk and then you suddenly forget that everyone drives on the wrong side of the road. So you're just sort of standing in front of a bloody car. It has got that holiday feel. Yes, it has. Enter in search area for rental apartments. Look at this. Oh, my God. Please say we... Oh, look at this. Oh, my God. Please say we can go in there. Please. Come on. Let me in there. Mwap, mwap, mwap. <laughs> Come on. I just wanted to go in the water. Wow. That's pretty cool, though, isn't it? I mean... <laughs> That was proper sad face moment, that was. <laughs> proper sad face. <laughs> I know, classic. Whatever next. But, I mean, to have this detail out here... Like, this is what I love about games, right? There's nothing to tell me to go out there. It's, you know, it's just that I wanted to go out there, and I suddenly saw a swimming pool, which I thought was fantastic. You know? Right, let's go back to our... It does look so inviting, doesn't it? Oh, I'm thinking back to the days when humans were allowed on holiday. I miss those days. I miss them so much. You can buy apartments and decorate them. <laughs> I'm just having a moment here. <laughs> this, is like, this game is made for me, isn't it? Absolutely made for me. Wait, look out, mate. What are you doing? Watch out. They're not very tourist aware around here, are they? The before times, I know, I know. It is getting to that point though. It hasn't even been hasn't even been a, a week yet, a full week of lockdown, and yet I can't wait to go on holiday whenever we're allowed and it's safe. Oh, I just can't wait to go on holiday and proper hear the ocean next to. Oh, I'm starting to get emotional. Proper hear the ocean next to the bloody beach, and yeah. Oh, here we are. Look, here we go. You're saying you can search rubbish, can you? Or is it just a certain area? Oh, please don't, Jay. I know. And I'm not joking. I can't wait. Uh, you know. And I think that... I think that... Um, we're actually going to appreciate things like that a lot more. Like, I love a holiday. But... I always look forward to coming home. And I don't really look forward to the holiday. I'm just like, oh, we're going on holiday. Oh, when is it? Two weeks. Lovely. Let's go. Get it done. Get back. But I think now it's changed me a little bit. I can't wait to go on holiday. And really just take my time and fully relax. It's going to be lovely. Yeah, you live on the coast but can't walk on the beach. I know. I know. You're going to have about five Mackie D's in one sitting. So true. Right, let's get going. Hopefully you're enjoying it though. Uh, I'm definitely enjoying playing. I'm not finished yet. We'll do about two and a half hours. So about another 35, 40 minutes I think we'll do. Would you like to see this on the channel? Not, I wouldn't say a regular, a bit like Euro Truck. Every now and again, I do a couple of weeks of it and then, you know, would you like to see more of this basically? I'm guessing you're gonna say yes, but it's always nice to know exactly what you're thinking because um, it's not just about me would you like to see this again and see how we how we get on really getting more employees getting a house awesome that's good yeah no we'll do some more of this yeah i want to see more of the management side fixing the buses yeah upgrading the buses fixing these bloody indicators <laughs> <laughs> I always like to ask Simpson. Yeah, I always like to ask. And hopefully people are honest, you know. <clears throat> Whenever I ask a question, I do just like, you know, because you might think, mm, nah. And I'm always interested, you know. I want to see you build that buggy and take it to the beach. Yes! I think there's a lot of work to be done in this. Yeah, a lot of work. But that's fine. We'll, we'll, um, 
I think I'll start to get everything set up on the button box, start doing all the doors manually. That'll be cool. Yeah, because we can walk, so we could actually... Um, we do love a vote coffin, I know, I know. We could actually walk to the beach, couldn't we? Theoretically, because you can walk there. It would be great to to see what they let you, how far they let you walk on the beach. And if you can walk across the ocean. I really do like the fact that you do have to slow down though. You can, oh, let's try it. Right, let's try it. Let's see how we get on. Right, I'm gonna put some power into it and drive it something like Grand Theft Auto. Let's see how let's see how, how we can make it. My foot's right down at the moment, alright? So it's gonna take all the fun out of it, because you're not meant to drive like this. Look, you're not you're not meant to drive like that. Okay, so it's leaning right over. Here we go. Uh oh. <laughs> let's just see. Let's see what what we can get away with. I don't wanna I don't wanna play the game like this. Okay, we're on a straight at the moment, so that's not that much problem. But what I will do is, um, I will download this beta version of the latest upgrade to the new Unreal Engine and see um, see how much it's improved, the performance, because I would love to turn... I've got the power to run this in 4K, but unfortunately the game isn't optimised, so we're not seeing the full extent of the graphics. Yeah, there is, but it's, um, it's all straight road at the moment. You reckon, Graham? No, exactly. It, it doesn't seem sim like when you do. Yeah, exactly. No, I, see it, I don't even want to do it anymore. It's far better driving properly, isn't it? It's far better. Oh, look at this little town. That will there ever be another DS stream? Maybe. Yeah, maybe. I still play it regularly. I was playing it last night again in bed on the old um, uh, phone through. Um, the remote play. Love it. I like a bit of everything, Harrison. Driving games, adventure. I literally like every game. Oh, you know, I've got um I've got some fantastic games to bring you on the channel. I've got an early access game very, very soon actually. I've got shitloads of games. Also, I am gonna bring Final Fantasy to the channel. Absolutely, I can't wait for that. But I'm gonna bring it to you early. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna be very early with it, all right. So if you if you're interested in Final Fantasy, hit subscribe because you're gonna see it here way before release day, way before. So uh, which I'm really really looking forward to. Can't wait for that. I played the demo again last night. Just can't wait for it. It's almost like it's it, you know for all of us, it's a perfect time at the moment just to get stuck into a brand new deep adventure game. And Final Fantasy is. Uh, just come along at the right time really, isn't it? How about Resident Evil? I've downloaded the demo, I just haven't had chance. Final Fantasy Episodic, your thoughts on this? Um, I don't mind because each game is meant to be like a, a proper AAA in itself. My only worry is, it's a bit like them magazines you get down, um, down the news agents, build a Spitfire you know, right, ep episode 1 you get this free, okay, by the time episode 20 is, is out there's just, uh, the percentage of people still buying it is so low and um, why would you buy episode 3 or 4 if you haven't got the previous one, so what I'm thinking is surely the only people that will buy episode 2 are those that have finished and completed episode 1, now what is the percentage of people that are going to go through and absolutely complete the whole game and get the next one so in a way I think it's good because it's going to really spread it out and give us a huge adventure another way of looking at it could be that they're really shooting themselves in the foot because a lot of people don't complete games do they myself included uh, yeah the number plate yeah I'm sure a lot of people here don't finish games so if you don't finish episode one what is the point of you getting episode two three and four so I, I don't know I don't know Tell me what you think. I, I don't mind it. As long as they're giving us value for money, I, I'm happy with it. Um, right, okay. Let's uh, let's go. I just think they might be doing themselves a disservice. <clears throat> Got another job. This is, this is good, isn't it, Codus? This is a good sign. We're basing it all on there. 
You're basing it all on you. I haven't seen that, Shane. Yeah. I haven't. Uh, geometry dress? No, no. <coughs> So this is one of our permanent orders. Oh, everyone relax. Codus is fine. He's been wedged out. It's fine. Everyone relax. It's so hard it can't be completed. That doesn't that doesn't get my juices flowing. Tech team, what are you talking about? These bus sims, they do attract a certain audience though, don't they? And uh, it, it's fine, I can deal with it, but they do attract a certain audience, don't they? They really do. <laughs> bus wankers. I wouldn't say that, Pug, but you can if you want. 99.9% .9 of the people that come are totally fine, but you do get a few excited people that just can't handle the busness. They can't handle the fucking busness of it all. The coachness, they just can't handle it. Yeah, although I do play in VR, yes. Hello, Christian, how are you? <coughs> the bus! <laughs> Don't start singing that, Graham. You set them all off. I've got proper croaky throat. <clears throat> it's not what you think it is. It's fine. And even if it is, it doesn't matter. <clears throat> oh, is that one of them containers you're talking about? Right, pull over time. Pull over time. Is this one of the containers? Could be, yes. Yeah. So when you see one, you've got to, you've got to um, go and inspect it. I like that. How do we know, though? Uh, I mean, oh, if it's got a lock on it. Okay. There's nothing showing up at the moment. That's a shame. But if that is the feature of the game, that's even better. That's even better, isn't it? I can't see any locks or anything. No, no. Here we go. Off for a walk again. Oh, what's up here? Hang on a minute. What's up here? A little shop up in the mountains. I have played Beat Saber, if you check the channel out, there's a video on there. I've played pretty much, not everything, but I've played a lot of stuff. Played a lot of stuff. The channel's been going for sort of three years now. So, uh, a bottle of Corona, yeah. I like Corona, there's nothing wrong with it. This looks a bit like the hills have eyes up here, isn't it? I love the fact that it's all modelled up here. Look, look at this. Look. And they do have little houses like this up in the, in the Spanish islands, don't they? Like, like Fuerteventura. Really desolate up here. I'm, I'm sort of scared. I'm very scared. I'm going to go. That seems a long way away, considering it only took me a couple of seconds. Oh, God, look at the traffic behind. <laughs> yeah, there's definitely a serial killer. I mean, you wouldn't want to... Yeah... No, I haven't played uh, Osme, no. Whoa, that looks a little bit deep there. I didn't check for guns. No, I should have done, shouldn't I? Okay, so we've got to look for containers, and they're a little bit like that. Okay. Everyone all right? Oh, hello, darling. Everyone all right? All good? Yeah, all good, all good. Oh, hello. All good at the back? Nice one. Right, let's get on here. Can you go to the beach? Well, that we will definitely try to go to the beach. <laughs> well, hello, love. <laughs> right, everyone. So, we're going down into resort. <laughs> we have got air conditioning for your comfort. Please make sure if you are looking to book any excursions, you do book through us. We do charge double. <laughs> they do, though, don't they? And they always try and make it like you can only get the excursions through them. 
make sure you book through us because we get all the worst deals. <laughs> <laughs> We have actually, yeah, you can go to the beach, yeah. We have actually got water now. I brought some. I don't know where that goes, though. So, like I say, during the week, I will, do during the week, I will download this um, new beta and just see what the differences are. See whether it does before. Is that one? Is that one? No, I'm looking out for stuff now. You know what I'm like. Yeah, you know what I'm like. Yeah, it's not a ride though, Simon, is it? It's just meant to be a coach uh, drive. Can everyone stop putting capitals? I can see the comments. You must know this, even if you are youngsters. You go into a stream and you start like spamming and spamming and doing uh, caps. You probably got more chance of being ignored. You must know that I read all the comments out and I see them all. Just chill, right? Oh, really? <laughs> just chill and I will see it. It's etiquette, you know? You, you're more likely to get ignored than... No, I do notice you, Lee. You're more likely to get ignored in a stream. Not necessarily mine, but in other streams. It's fine, just chill. We're having a... If we was all sitting around a table, you wouldn't start shouting at me, would you? To get your point across. You'd just go... You'd just wait, wouldn't you? You know? Yes, Ronaldo, it is, yeah. I see all comments. I see all of them. Hello, Nathan. Oi, oi. <laughs> Patience, exactly. We're having a nice little chat together. It's all good. I'm so chilled, I've turned it, yeah. <laughs> oh, here he goes. Here he goes. Well, maybe, Ross. Yeah, without repeating myself, maybe. Yeah, yeah, there is a, uh, there is a beta version on PC that um, is available for download if you've brought the game where they're updating this game to the very latest version of the Unreal Engine so that could mean good times and possibilities of it coming to console but that's me, <laughs> Red, leave off but that's me saying that, that's not like an official rumour or anything like that I'm not trying to start a rumour um, yeah that's me saying, hmm, interesting This is my real job, Tech. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a full-time professional YouTuber <laughs> and bus driver. <laughs> He's a bus driver, yeah. Me indicators are working now, so it's fine. I'm not planning on getting Osmi, no, no, or Omzi, no. Right, out you lot, get out, get out my bus. Get out of my pub. There you go. Go on, you lot. Go off to your English bars. Your bingo. Your full breakfasts. Your Heinz baked beans. Go on. Go and enjoy your holiday in, in Spain. <laughs> I've mentioned this, Steve. And maybe. Yeah, maybe. All stops have been approached. No passenger has been left at a stop. That's good. That's what we want to. Uh, we want to hear that, don't we? Shame about no luggage, though, because it's fantastic that these side panels open. It's just a shame. But then this is just a. Maybe this is because this is just a, a sort of, um, a sort of little trip, isn't it? Maybe you've got set up airport runs where you'll take um, luggage. I don't know. I don't know. Right, I think we're going back to the garage. Then I'll probably leave it there. And I'll go and download this other version and come back um, during the week with it. Are you punished for hitting curve stones? No, Warrior. No, you're not. No. Yeah, I don't think the game's got baggage, but it's fine. We're not going to hold it, hold it against it. It's fine. Hello, sweetheart. You're oh, look at that. <laughs> She's not a day over eighty. See you later, Harrison. It's, I love the inclines and the the gradients. It's cool. Was definitely a kid. Get out of it. That was that old lady. 
What's this TV shop? Hang on, hold up, hold up, hold up. There's a TV shop. I need to know more. What's a TV shop for? This shop will order you various kinds of electronics for your private apartment. Oh my god, this is going to be so cool. This is going to be awesome. We can have a we can have a big screen TV up on there and drive the bus all day. What happens when you run out of fuel on truck driver? Uh, well, have a guess. You've got three guesses. <laughs> you get put to the put back to the garage. Your charity game, yeah, 25 quid. See you later, Unpopular. That's such an unfair name for you, Unpopular Gaming. You're a good guy. Yeah, change it to Popular Gaming, go on. You throw a chair. Hello, Andy, how are you? Yeah, you two were in a funny mood last night, weren't you? Oh, I don't like your music. Oh, you can't like mine then. I was watching you. Oh, did you hear that? <laughs> There's a TV shop, I need to know more. I'm, inqu I'm an inquisitive gamer, what can I say, you know? I'm not sure what you mean by that, Dean. I know you've put it a few times, I'm not ignoring it. Um, how to get paid on Twitch, I just don't know what you mean, Dean. How to get paid on Twitch, Are you, is that what you're asking? Yeah, but it was very hurtful, Andy, and I felt the pain in your comment. When he says... Uh, Graham, I can honestly say I've never clicked on any music video you've posted here. I was like, oh, and Graham's like, what? Why would you say that? <laughs> I was like, oh, that hurt. That hurt. Germany, come in Germany. How are you? It was harsh. It was. Just the way he typed it out. I can honestly say, Graham. <laughs> Right, we're looking around for containers. We're looking around. You never know. I want to see a railway, but I mean, I wonder if we ever get into a town as well. Right, there's a container. Sorry, everyone. We're going to stop. Oh, <coughs> the false feedback's pretty good as well. Sorry, everyone. We need to go and see if there's any anything in this container. I think this is one of them smaller ones again, so I'm not sure... Yeah, there's nothing here. I want to find something in a container. That would be brilliant. Can hardly contain. Yeah. It's showing up on the map. Oh, okay. Okay, I've got you. Oh, not reverse. Tell you what, a couple of hours in. Oh, look at the steering wheel. Definitely enjoying that. Definitely. Oh, look, it's the, oh we're at the airport. Look at that. Oh, should we try and get on the runway? <laughs> we have to get on the runway. Um, just um, uh, just a bit of treasure, Ken. Yeah, a bit of treasure. Can you do no manual? No, you can see just down there. It's a uh, drive and um, neutral and reverse, so there, it's an automatic bus. So we get all the special lanes because we're uh, we're a coach and a bus. Oh, did you mind? Well, this one. Oh, nice one. There's an option skip just before that container. Oh, okay, yeah. An open skip. Is that what you're looking, David? As well? Have I got to put um, open skips onto my list as well? Will God's be getting this on his PC? I think the real question there, Rocky, is will God's get his PC? <laughs> That's good, Martin. All good. The only thing I would say is, like I said at the beginning, it's very system hungry. Very system hungry. Um, but there is a, a, a more optimised version coming soon. 
Yes, Graham, yeah, not very high, no, I wouldn't call it very high end, and you can still turn the, the settings down, but yeah, it's um, it's not running as it should, certainly not. You know, if you compare this to something like the Sato Corsa, which uh, I can crank right up, then no, it's not running the same, but it's running fine. £27 cactus on um, Steam. <laughs> Right, let's go back to our little office and see what they actually want us to do. What's next? The poor God's not even here to defend himself. Like I said in the stream last night, I tweeted out something the other day and it was like, oh, going live in an hour or whatever. It's just a normal tweet. And someone who I don't even know, I don't, I'm not sure who it was, they replied back, has God got his PC yet? Oh, I did laugh. I did laugh. It was just so random and just so, yeah, it was brilliant. Right, let's go up to this restaurant. It'd roll over. <laughs> uh, let's, let's just go and um, fully discover this restaurant. Sightseeing tour, okay. Yeah, so we need to go up to these. We need to go up to them. Uh, see you later, Ken. Thank you, mate. Using God's PC to write it, yeah. Right, let's go back and... Uh, yeah, Graham, I'm enjoying it, mate. And uh, everyone else seems to be enjoying it as well. It uh, looks like an interesting little game. Can we actually drive this in to, to the workshop? Does it do that, or have we got to... Can it only go in at a certain time? Oh, it can go in there! Oh my god, we can actually park it in here! See, I love little things. This is what I love about sim games. You know, there's nothing exciting about driving a bus into a garage. Trust me, there's not. But when you can do it because I want to do it in a game, it suddenly becomes, you know, I don't know. I mean, look at this! This is my garage! This is what I like about sim games. It's cool. It's cool. It lets you do things that you just don't or wouldn't even... I, I wouldn't want to do this in real life. I don't want to be a bus driver. I've got no interest in, in doing that. But suddenly in a game, it just becomes interesting. I like it. Yeah, the graphics have got a soft focus. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Free DLC. Yeah, I did um, download that. Yes, it's, it's like a mini bus, isn't it, Punk? Right, open the schedule again and assign this permanent order to your employee okay so there's the schedule after you successfully completed this oh okay so it's a little bit like bus sim after you successfully completed this order yourself it has been certified so you have to dry it drive it the very first time yourself that's pretty much the same as bus sim the reason you're doing it is to certify it i like that that's cool okay so we're going to take this uh is it this one yeah it was that one we're going to click that we're going to get one of my employees to do it using the only coach I've got. Why won't it let me do that? Why won't it let me do it? Click that. Click that. Yes. Okay, so that's now assigned to the employee. <clears throat> Go to the other computer. All right. All right, I will. Oh, the other one here. Sorry, the other one here. This is inventory. Click on this button to see your stock of snacks and drinks for the sightseeing tours. By clicking on this button, you can see your current stock of spare parts for the vehicle repair. So we know we've got some water, haven't we? We brought we brought some water. Okay. What we're doing with this water, I don't know. When uh, when we're selling it, I've got no idea. Spare parts, we haven't got any, so I've got no idea where to get them. We've got loads of water because I brought them in the shop. Um, so that's fine. Go to the filing cabinet. I like the way it's telling me everything. Yeah, this, uh, this is this is uh, the best way to talk to employees, isn't it? Go over there, do that. Go back there, do that. <laughs> That's what he's doing to me. Right, where's the filing cabinet? What filing cabinet? Where? That one. Click on these buttons to see different kinds of contracts. You have the choice between vehicle insurance loss insurance contracts for wi-fi oh my god you can have wi-fi on there as well 
Contracts of spare parts. Oh, okay. So that maybe that's where we get the spare parts. Yeah, Cyril's mum. Who was it? Who was it? By clicking on this button, you can switch to the column. Clicking on this button. Okay, that's fine. So vehicle insurance. We definitely want insurance, don't we? What a hundred percent. A thousand pound a month though. Wi-Fi services. Thirty pound a month for ten gig. I mean. I don't know how that's... Um, I know at the moment I'm driving without insurance. I don't know how that's going to work. I mean, would you just get more money per ticket the more features you've got? That's that's all I'm guessing. Spare parts. Yeah, okay. Indicator. Let's buy an indicator. <laughs> Delivered in seven days? One day, yeah. Right, let's get an indicator. Do we have to confirm that? That's it, that's done. So hopefully we'll be able to go into the garage and fix that indicator. Let's get why. Uh, okay. Oh, it's all gone. No, it hasn't. It's there. Well, let's get 25% of insurance. I mean, what's the point of 25%? You're better off not being insured on you. You want 100%. Unless that's the access paid. Well, we need some insurance. So let's go with that one. Go to the calculator in the next room. Finances. Click on this button, you receive an overview. Um, if you want to see more details, these buttons allow you to receive new loans. So we can have loans. Okay. So um, overall expenses. Yeah. Okay. We've made that much revenue. Spare parts. Salaries. So we have got some scheduled trips as well. So that's that's proper money. Go to the pin in this room. There's a lot to remember here, isn't there? A lot. Statistics. This button will give you an overview of your personal performance. Okay. Hello, Skiddy. Uh, completed tours. We've lost tours yet. Drivers won. Oh, we haven't got any workshop staff, so I'm guessing we're going to have to get someone to fix the bus. Yeah. Yeah. You're not happy with me. Why not? You don't sound happy with fucking anyone, Skiddy. <laughs> it's either me or Potty, isn't it? <laughs> Potty, Potter, sorry. What are you not happy with? What are you not happy with? Uh, okay, let's go there. That's fine. It's just showing me through all all the... Uh, I might call him Potty from now on. Go outside over the yard and enter the word shop. Yeah, we're calling Potty. He'll love, he'll love that, won't he? He will love that. I watch a member stream, but how dare you suggest that? I always mention a certain child's name. Uh, you do. <laughs> you do. Right, bus repair. A list of vehicles in need of repair. The left-hand button, you've got condition components. To make a repair, you need mechanics. Additionally, you may require spare parts. Okay. That's fine. Oh, it, we're green at the moment. Oh, right, I do. Sorry, yeah. Uh, okay. So we've got a repair. But we can do an external repair. We can do body damage. We can do the whole lot. Should we fix everything? Should we do that? No, that stream will never go public. <laughs> Did you watch at the end? <laughs> Miley Cyrus's password. Wow. Um... Oh, I don't think we've got... Uh, oh, you have to pick it. Okay. You have to pick it. Well, let's do an oil change. Let's see what happens. The workshop appointment. Okay. Okay, that's fine. You're saying bottom three. Okay. The vehicle's already there. Okay. Let's go back then. We're going to need to... Um... Oh, the expansion. Get in your car. All right. That's a service car, is it? It says get in your car. I don't know whether it's this one. Oh, unlocked at level four. Okay, it's not. It's this one. I don't really like the actual car, but uh, it's fine. I don't like the car driving. But it's, it's okay. The red dot means it needs to be repaired. I've got you. <clears throat> I think you have to maintain the car as well. There's... um. There's a lot going on here, isn't there? 
car's very dirty, yeah. Although it seems cleaner than before, strangely enough, from the inside. <clears throat> Open the map. Uh, to search a waypoint. Oh, maybe it wants me to set a waypoint, does it? Does it want me to come here to an industrial estate? Is that what it's asking me? I think it probably does. Yes. It's a better experience um, than bus simulator. I mean, there's, there's no secret in that. Absolutely not. There's no secret. Uh, car. Um, turn. Add axis. It's that one. And it's that one. Except. That's better. That's better. There's a lot of simulator management. A lot, actually. Um, too much, maybe? Maybe. Too much for me, possibly? Yeah, maybe. But there's a lot going on. There's a lot of stuff to, to work with. And I suppose in the end, maybe, is it the fact that you are running it as a, as a management sim? You've got people working for you, going out. Um, but then you've still got to do that route the very first time, haven't you? Even brought Internet Cafe Manager and played that. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> we all need to get out more, literally. We do, don't we? But we can't, so... Right, hang on. Let's stop here. I need to reset button as well. Um, controls... You are a crazy man. How do you know? Um, switch camera. And yes, I can see they're all red. Unfortunately, it does that, but it, it works. It's a little bit... It's a little bit weird. Center camera. Uh, let's get rid of that. Add key. That one. Except, yeah, for some reason it all goes red. But if you if you take it out, the whole thing stops working. This is why I was playing it um, last night. No, it's not working. It's not working. But that's fine. I'm not planning on being in the car very long. It's bus simulator. Right, we're going to see what they want to do with this expansion. And then I think I'll leave it there. Um... Looks like an incomplete... Yeah, I, I, hopefully it's getting more love and attention. The fact that they're thinking about, or, or currently up to updating the uh, the game engine to the latest version of Unreal means that they haven't left it behind, have they? From India. Nice one. Welcome, mate. Welcome. We went left last time there, didn't we? So this is uh, this is new. <coughs> I must say, I've really enjoyed uh, my time playing it so far. Absolutely. And the fact that you can buy houses and go to the TV shop and buy stuff. Wow. <coughs> I'm not sure of the actual release date, uh, Senny. Oh no, no, we did come here before, didn't we? Yeah, we did. No, it's not on um, Xbox One, no. It does chrome, doesn't it? Yeah, it looks cool. I do need to mess around with the seating position. Uh, I can't see the buttons for that. Whoa. So we're looking to expand at the moment already, which is cool. What's your obsession with TV shops? <laughs> no, I haven't got an obsession with TV shops. I've got an obsession with detail. The fact that you can buy your own house and go to the TV shop. That's, that's, uh, oh, I think you passed over and go, David, don't say that. Okay, we've got to keep looking for stuff. Right. Uh, Reese, 27 quid from Steam. Yeah, exactly, Steve. It's, it's escapism. That, that's what it is, escapism. That's the best thing about video games. I can be driving a bus. I can go and drive a race car. I can go into space. Um, we can go to war. All these things you can do 
through the escapism of video games and there's no other medium like it really I mean yes there is films so you can do all of that in films but films is a very um, you know passenger activity what's this hang on let's pull over looks like there's a but um, with games it's an interactive experience and that's what I like <coughs> It come up with a camera location, so I don't know if it's uh, you've got to collect sort of picturesque um, stuff or. I drive in a car interior. I know, Jake. I know, mind blown. Right, what is this ca? What is this camera? <laughs> uh oh, a casino. What's this camera location? I mean, we can't go in there, can we? No. It's quite clever the way they've done that to make that look as if it's... Uh, it's a bit like modelling. I do modelling, so I've got model railway. And you can get um, backdrops like that to put behind a building to make it look uh, make it look busy. It's almost exactly what they've done here, modelling that. I like that. It's got to be round the back then. Why is there an icon here? Does anyone... David, why is there an icon? What am I doing? Just exploring at the moment. I, I like exploring. But why is there... A camera icon. One to five. Yeah, one to five of the Spanish island. Yeah. I do modelling, yeah. <laughs> yeah, one to five. Yeah, you keep you keep putting that up. Um, you keep spamming that without me even having a chance to answer. Stop it. Yes, I do play GTA. Yes, I do. Mostly on Twitch. I'm going to start streaming back on Twitch, actually. Now I'm doing more streams. So, uh, you'll see me over there again. What game is this? Check the title. It's all in there. It's all in there. Come on. Switch on. Don't make me do all the work for you. <laughs> Should be in the description trials, yeah. Come on. Don't make me do all the work for you. Oh, Steve, don't join in with them. Right, let's look out for um, containers. I thought about doing one of them 5M servers, but... Mm, don't know. Don't know. I've got enough servers going at the moment. <laughs> there might be a farming sim one soon, isn't there, Codus? Yes, yeah, in Spain, it's a, um, a, a real-life island called Fuerteventura. So you can definitely you can definitely chuck the um, the car around. No, Elite's not coming back. No. Do you not get bored of repeating yourself? In what way? What What do I keep saying? You mean answering people's questions? No, I don't get bored with that. Um, if that, If that's what you mean. What bits am I repeating? I mean, you, you know, when you stream, you're inevitably going to get asked the same questions. And if you don't like answering the same answers, then stop streaming, isn't it? Really. If you mean I'm repeating myself, yeah, I do sometimes. But, you know, it's all good. Shirag, you'll be gone, mate. Don't come in the spam. What's the point? What's the point? Right, get him out. Get him out. Grab him by the scruff of his neck. Random teenagers, thank you very much. You my friend on PlayStation, uh, bro? Am I, are you asking? Or, yeah, just send me a, um, a friend request, yeah. Yeah, get hold of his... Get him by the scruff. Thank you very much, Random. That's very generous of you, and I appreciate that. Thank you. Get him by the scruff. Chuck him outside. And don't let him back in. <laughs> There'll be murders. No, you have to be patient, yeah. And sometimes repeating yourself adds to the experience. Yeah, exactly. I don't know why people come in and spam, but... It's bus sim, isn't it? Just the, just the word, the title. Bus sim. <gasps> oh, bus sim. 
<laughs> Where are we driving? We're driving to the hills, um, a, a garage in the hills to expand, apparently. That's what we're doing. Yeah, you don't need to report anyone. It's all good. Oh, did you dot bags? Nice one. So you can see the frames are a little bit glitchy up here. Hopefully that new um the new version coming will sort that. It's a big map. Yeah, I mean it's uh, one t it's a scale is five times smaller than the real island basically. And the real island's obviously huge, isn't it? So yeah, it's a big old map. It is a big map. What's your favorite uh, biscuit dunker? Oh god, there's so many. I mean, you can't beat a custard cream. Dunk, swallow, dunk, swallow. Straight in there, perfect size for a, a, a plop in the mouth, you know. And I like the challenge of leaving how long you can leave in there, you know. So maybe custard creams. Yeah, don't mention that yet. And you've got work to be doing, Codus. Oh, that's a bit... Oh, that's a bit disorientating. Whoa, 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 whoa. The reset button didn't work, which was annoying. <clears throat> that sounds going to resonate in my head. He really wanted to do something on GTA. I don't know what it was. Right, let's look out for containers. Oh, here we are. Garage... Garage Wars. Oh, this is cool. So maybe this is where we're going to expand and work and buy. This is cool. Cool. I like it. I mean, this is better better presented than... Than um, say Euro Truck, isn't it? The way that we've actually gone and discovered a new garage. I like it. I like it. Yeah, it looks like it got abandoned in 1985, but then I probably look like that as well. <laughs> Alright, let's park up here. Starsky and Hutch style. Yeah, you can mod it. Yeah, you can. There's no. Uh, there's. I had. I did have a look. There's no graphical mods or anything like that. But there's plenty of skins and all that sort of stuff. Oh my god! You can go in here as well. That's it. Oh, perfect for a bus. Um, a bus yard, isn't it? Look at this. Look. And I wonder if we can kit this out as well. Yeah, there's a lot going on here. A lot. No, the only the only mods I saw was for skins. Yeah. Go to the garage. Halls. Oh, you gotta click it. Oh, to expand your fleet, you have to buy uh, garage halls. If you've made enough money, you can buy. Well, hopefully, I have because the game sent me up here. You do not have enough money. That was weird, though, wasn't it? The expansion. Open the map again. All right. Click on the fast travel button in the upper right. Um, click on so you can go back there. Okay. So you can go up here. Choose a fast travel location. And we should be able to go back to our office. Maybe that's all it wanted us to do. Yeah, just teasing me with goodies. I can't afford. Damn you, game. I was really up for that. But I'm pretty impressed, I must say. I'm going to end it very, very soon. But um, very impressed. And yeah, you will see it again. Yeah, absolutely. Um, get in your car. I don't want to get in the car. I want to get in the bus. The accommodation. So we're going to... Oh, this is where we can go to the TV shop. Get ready. <laughs> get ready, mate. Here we go. See you later, Ken. Oh, you're going to miss the TV shop, Ken. See you later, mate. I really like this idea of having the car to to flit around in doing jobs. I really like that. Something about that, isn't it? Random, thank you very much. That's gener very generous of you. No, it's not on PlayStation. Um, I mean, there's a slim possibility, but no, officially, absolutely not. No, it's not. 
And uh, that is very generous of you. Thank you very much. I'm staying for the TV shop. I don't know if the TV shop will happen now. I don't know. If you could ride a horse on this, you'd be all over it. Maybe you can. Colin lives again in Furt Aventura in a tube of Yoo-Hoo. Yeah, of course, Skiddy. Yeah, of course. I think I like the fact that you have to get into your car in this to go and um, run errands and stuff. You have to. Whoa, 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 whoa. How do you become a chat mod? Just keep spamming in capitals. That always works. Yeah, just keep spamming and ignoring everyone. That's the best way. Okay, I will do it. <laughs> yeah, Discord's in links in the description. <laughs> I was just joking, by the way. But yeah, let's oh, right challenge for you for the next five minutes. Everyone has to talk in caps only. Everyone. <laughs> let's see what the chat would look like if it's just caps. Right, you're not allowed to talk about any... You, you have to use caps on everything. <laughs> it really looks... I will time the whole channel out. Yeah, just caps. You're only allowed. <laughs> Let's go. Please go to... Everyone is shouting at me. <laughs> Brilliant. Love it. <laughs> I love the way this stream is always so happy to get involved and join in. It's just fun. I love it. So if someone comes in now and talks in normal lowercase, I'm going to call them the spammer. Oh, hey, stop doing lowercase, mate. Time him out. <laughs> right, that's it now. <laughs> that's it. Stop now. Oh, whoa. Right, no more. Let's, let's go back to normal. You're all mods. That's it. You're all mods. <laughs> well, that was funny. Container. No, was it? Oh, no, don't say that. <laughs> Chat mods for everyone. Right, let's go back to normal. Let's just stop it, all right? I think it will, Steve. Yeah, I think it will. This is not a, an official rumour. I think there's a bloody good chance that this is coming to console. Pete, Pete wants a shout out. We're always having fun here, Robbo. Yeah, I think there's a, I think there's a chance anyway. I think there's definitely a chance. Otherwise, why would they be revisiting it after all this time, you know? This game hasn't been hugely updated. It's been sort of left. And suddenly now there's a new... Um, oh, there's a... All right, let's go and have a look. Oh, oh, hang on a minute. No, we've already looked there. Yeah, we've looked there. Alfie, how are you, mate? How'd he park that car? Look, look at that car. He wants to... <laughs> he, he wants to... Look at that car. That's some dodgy. That's some dodgy parking. That is. Is there a nudist beach? Ant Man. Come on. I don't know. I'll have a look for you. I was wondering that myself. Right. So I will go once we work out where we're going to actually live. Yeah. See you later, Ken. Uh, what? Because we're driving to our accommodation now, so once we work out where we're going to live, we live quite a way away from the the actual bus station, don't we? So that glitching, that isn't the stream. That is just dropping frames. That's what the, this game does. Um, all any bad review for this game has all been based around the optimization. But like I say, there is a beta. Which I will be downloading and trying, and I'll stream it as well to see whether we can see any difference um, and have a good chat about it. What about a skip? Can you look in skip for? Is that a skip, or is that someone's house? <laughs> oh, it, right. Uh, is it? Yeah, it is a container. So let's go have a look at this one. Let's have a look at this one. There's no dot on the map or anything. No. So I haven't found any actual rubbish yet, have I? Yeah. Is that where the body's buried? Yeah. 
X-Plane 11, I have got X-Plane 11, and I'll be honest, it's, it's very advanced, so probably not. But I am waiting for Microsoft Flight Sim. Uh, that's the one I'm literally waiting for. I don't know if you know my channel or my gaming room, but there is a corner um, with an extra seat and a flight rig. All waiting. It's just waiting. It's just waiting. <clears throat> there might be a TV in there. There might be. We'll never know, will we? I would like to find some treasure. It does, Adam. Yeah, I can't wait. It has got more... Um, I think Andy said about the muted colours and the... It has got a sort of realistic look. Um, I wouldn't say... I don't know. Would... would well, another... Oh, bloody hell. Another question for chat. We love a questionnaire. Do you think this is better looking? than Euro Truck. Just a yes or no. I'm interested in what you think. I'm sort of undecided. In one way, no. But in another way, it's got it's got a very different, more realistic uh, look. Yeah. Right, let me know what you think. Uh, it's no's. Okay. Couple of yeses. Quite a few yeses. Mostly no's, though. No, Promod, yeah. Yeah, more refined. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, no, I think it is a... I don't think it looks as good. It's got... It's got a different look. It's got a different look. Yeah, more realistic, but definitely not. Yeah. I've got you. Do you think servers will be free to host? Well, I'm hoping, uh, Skiddy, that it's included in the game. Like, you know, um, uh, local hosting. Yeah, I mean, you might be able to do an actual... You might be able to buy a server for console, but they'd still be paid for. But what racing game comes to console that where you can't host a multiplayer? It wouldn't be very good for the game. So I think they're going to have to change that. And I, I just, I don't know why it isn't in the game anyway, even the PC version. Yeah, I don't know why. It annoys me. It's fine, I've got the server and it's on random now, which is good. So every time you go in, you're going to get um, a different track, which is great. But why can't we just host it? It's the same as Race Room. You know, you need a server. So if they're going to do that in on the console, that's going to upset a lot of people. Yeah. Yeah, exactly, Skiddy. That's why I think um, there's no way they will make you pay um, on console to be included. It has to be. What are we actually... Park in the yard? What yard? Okay, maybe it's here. There's a little sofa icon, so uh, let's park up here. Any more news on SnowRunner? The last video I did um, showed you quite a bit. Um, uh, have a look back on the channel. It's about five or six videos back. Go to the house. What house? What, this one? The Hammerin. The Hammerin. This shop will enable you to order various kinds of furniture for your private... Okay, cool. Where? Oh, it's up there. It's 100 metres up there. Do you reckon I can get away with leaving it parked there? Why not? It's only up here. No, uh, anonymous. No, this is single player. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to be doing um, Euro Truck and American Truck all from tomorrow onwards. I'm not saying it'd be t tomorrow, but the idea being is that um, it's a new month. We come third, so hopefully we'll get a trophy for that on our on our um, on our page. But yeah, new month new opportunities to see if we can come first oh so I'm living up here am I okay yeah 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 I can, I can do this if you see this symbol on the map you've discovered an apartment after the purchase you will see this icon on the map and you've activated so we can fast travel there okay now click on buy it yeah I'll have that so can we go in Yes, we can. What a poxy little... Oh, my God. After you've acquired your first property, you can arrange it. Click on the uh, displayed interaction fields to buy different items of furniture. So we can... Uh, you do it from here, do you? Change... You need a hardware store. Okay, so that's good. So we can just change this right up. 
Change painting. Yeah, this is good. This is good. What's that? What's what's in here? Hey, we've got a toilet. And this toilet roll. It comes included. If anything, we paid all that money for the toilet roll. And it's the house we got free. That's the sort of life we live in at the moment. Yeah, yeah, this is cool. This is good. I love this... Uh, I love this customization bit. I like that. It's, that's really good. Really good. So this is why I said earlier on, and it wasn't slagging busts him off. This is obviously a far more detailed and thought out game. Far more detailed. And some of it people won't want to do. You know, there's um you know, there's a lot of people that'd be like, What but I don't wanna I don't want to rearrange my flat. I want to play bus sim, you know? I wanna drive buses and I think you can do that. This sort of stuff obviously is optional isn't it but it's cool that it's in here you gotta admit it's cool it's cool there's a lot to do here a lot and obviously the more we um have to remember when we bloody cars park now the more we discover the more we earn the more we can buy it gives you something to spend spend it all on all the bikes are really cool as well kawasaki It is a nice little gaff, and you're all invited as well. You're all invited. Why are they stopping? Have I messed? Have I messed the AI up? I think I have. You know, by parking there, everyone has stopped. I wonder if I have. Let me move my car up a little bit. I think I've messed it up. Let's have a look. Let's move it up. Let's go back out now. Wow, something's upset them, isn't it? Yeah, something's upset them. Right, that is it, everyone. Hopefully you've enjoyed um, this little stream showing you Tourist Bus Simulator. I've been saying for a little while that I was going to bring this um, to the channel, so hopefully you've enjoyed it. Feel free to leave me a little cheeky like. Most importantly, feel free to subscribe right now before you go so you can come back in and join in another stream. But that is it, everyone. I will see you at 8 o'clock tonight for three hour endurance on Gran Turismo at Bathurst. That is it. Enjoy your day. See you next time.